How's it going, guys? Welcome to the Fire Red Leaf Green 2024 and 8% Glitchless Racing Tournaments. This is uh, round one, the first match between Amoeba, Bang, and Peasants. I am joined by joined with Truly for commentary. Yo, yo, how's it going? Should be a good matchup. We got two emulator runners yeah, and one good. console runner. Um, yeah, uh, just, honestly, just... I'm looking forward to it for sure. Like, this is low key, like a, a, in my opinion, a really solid round one race. Like, Bang's a very solid runner. Peasants is a relatively new runner, I think, right? But they've yeah. been doing a lot of races. Um, and Amoeba's obviously um, one of the best, I would say. So, um, should be a very fun race. I'm looking forward to it. Yeah, something to note as well is um, they are all doing early surge, which is pretty interesting. So uh, yeah, I would say a lot of runners have too. defaulted to late surge because of the consistency. But um, I've I've done two races with Amoeba personally, and with him doing early surge, and it's pretty strong when it goes well. So absolutely. Um, but it is interesting because, yeah, 45 to 50 minutes in, you know, anything could really happen. So that yeah, fight is very unpredictable. That, yeah, that could so. definitely be a big swing, especially if they're all doing it. So, I mean, all three doing it. I mean, that's actually kind of nice, though. I, I yeah. like that. Like, that they're yeah. all three doing it. So makes it a lot more interesting, I feel like. Um, but, yeah, uh, I'm not sure we're going to get in. Okay. How yeah, we got good. the game feed now. Uh, the we timer's go. going down. And we got this really nice layout as well. Um, super cool looking. Um, thanks to Sai J for that one. Yeah, this is pretty nice. I like this. Hop right into it. The, the emulator delay. Yep. And so again. Um, Due to the inconsistencies with MGBA, uh, emulator runners will have a roughly 25% 25 second penalty, just because it, it, the game emulator just runs a little bit faster than console does. So yeah. we try to even it out a little bit. So uh, it's not an exact science because there's not an exact emulator, unfortunately, but um, yeah. we do what we can so yeah. everyone can be involved. Because obviously the the setup for console is a little extensive. So yeah, for sure. It's just a lot easier, you know, if you, for convenience sake, to, uh, is everything alright on peasant side here? I'm not sure what's, I guess, am I crazy? Uh, yeah. Oh, I, I, oh he, okay, he caught up, I think, okay. yeah. Okay. I think it was, he was just stinking him up, probably. Yeah, peasants is a Australian runner, and, uh. Wow, really? So it's yeah, he's a much different time zone. We've we've been we've been doing I've been doing some practice races with him. Um, I mean, that makes sense that like they were doing the races with us because like the time that makes a lot of sense for the. <clears throat> like when they were doing them with us. Checking out these Squirtles. I mean, I really like Amoebas and Bangs. Um, Peasants, yeah, peasants, I mean, it's fine as well, I guess, but I mean, we'll see how it goes for uh, some more early search. Yeah, I mean, and again, you're, you're going to see Rash is going to be the, the most popular Squirtle. Again, when you compare the three viable Squirtles, you get Modest, Mild, and Rash. Modest is going to be minus attack plus special. Mild is minus defense plus special attack. And Rash is minus special defense. And special defense is going to be the least important stat of the three, so it's going to have the least impact as compared to the other two. Yep. So most people will probably run Rash, um, but all three are fine, but yep. it's, it's, they're very situational, so... Uh, the when it comes over to... Over-under, 0.5 over-under, rival one deaths. <laughs> I'll go with the under. The way the rival one fight works is that as, as long as you don't tail whip on the on in the fight, you cannot miss tackle. Um, you obviously can get crit by the rival, but it generally requires two criticals to die, so it's a very likely fight to win. Um, again, criticals being one in sixteen chance. Um, 
The Bulbasaur can also growl you as well, which can mess with your turns yeah. as well, so... Um, rival 1 deaths are really, really uncommon. If they do happen, it's pretty bad. Um, <laughs> like, really bad, because <laughs> yeah. you need the experience to continue, so... Absolutely. Alwo, thank you for the raid, we appreciate it. Um, but... As far as, like, Rival 1, like... Yeah, it's always super troll with Rival 1, because, like, you spend all this time hitting a Squirtle, and then you finally, like, get one, and then you get growled, and it's so troll. Yeah, so the way the way that Growl works is that um, if you have 25 plus attack neutral, you can just attack in, and you, you won't reduce your attack by too much. Uh, if you're underneath that, you generally are going to have to Tail Whip twice to get the least amount of turns to finish the fight. But again, as soon as you Tail Whip, you can miss Tackle, so there can be combinations of getting Growl into getting crit into t into tackle miss it's it it can go really bad but yeah um looks like amoeba killed a level two rat bang just killed a level three peasant's got a level three bird not great it's gotta run away from that level three birds are really annoying because majority of the time you cannot three shot them and like I yeah, it's know. favored when you have 21 plus attack, but it it's yeah, it's one of those things. But the other thing that with with Pidgey is that it only knows tackle, whereas yeah, Raditz knows tail whip. So you know, and if it crits you, it's got same type of attack bonus critical. So it, you can die to a bird. I mean, it, it, um, the runners are gonna have to get a little bit of experience, um, which is why you see they'll they'll take down either a rat or a bird. That's great. Um. Because you need to be able to get um, level eight for the Geo Dude in in the gym. So um, some runners will opt to uh, kill two things and get Bubble because it Bubble is going to yeah. be a little more consistent for catches and also makes the the big Weedle fight in in the forest a little more consistent. Yeah, so absolutely, you can like if especially if you have Bubble, like you have Bubble and potions, you can like skip saving sometimes for Sammy. It's just just a little bit of time save that you can like gain sometimes just on top of just bubble just being good too. But the only really the only real downside to bubble uh, in this beginning section is that they they have to you have to catch uh, flyer and a cutter and mm -hmm. it's all it's really important to understand the catch rates um, so that you don't cuz you only have five pokeballs and if you burn them all it's really bad so um, a lot of times, uh, a second bubble will. If you, if you usually you'll bubble off the bat, and a lot of times you won't hit the 78% catch rate threshold. And a lot of times, if you bubble again, it'll, it'll, you know, it'll kill the the thing, and then you can't catch it. So because yeah, exactly. miners are gonna try and get, they want to be, they're they're gonna attack twice, pretty much every time, because you you don't want to deal with a 62% chance to catch something. You want to either deal with the 78 or just the 99.9, .9, so... And especially whenever you still need the extra experience to get to level 7, like, tackling twice, like, really isn't that bad, because if you crit on the second tackle and kill it, you're gonna get bubble anyway, so it's kind of like... It's not, like, that big of a deal, so... Yeah. I always, like, sometimes giving it that second tackle, it's like, sometimes it's good if you crit, like... Yeah, and and if and if you if you crit like an an extra thing, I mean it's you'll just get level twelve for Geo, for Onyx. It's I mean it's not the end of the world, but it, it's just kind of wasted time. Yeah. So. Bang got his level seven. Amoeba's not seven yet, but he does have a rat. Did Amoeba opt to not get bubble there? Yeah, he did not He's, get bubble. That's. I think hmm. he got two route one encounters, I believe, and killed one, caught one. So very nice. Uh, very fast, but not getting bubbles kind of troll. But you, you can still get bubble in the forest, I guess, just killing like a Caterpie or... Well, you whatever. generally... Yeah, I mean, I wouldn't mess with a Caterpie, because you can lose a lot of turns there. Um, yeah, true. I would say one of the big safety strats of racing that a lot of people do, um, because you don't want to run into a situation where you uh, don't have a potion for the gym, there's a third mm. potion that's in the forest. So a lot of times if runners are kind of low, um, you'll opt to get it because, again, with the fights in the gym, if you don't have a potion, you, and you're going to save, obviously, for anything that could happen, but <laughs> if you got to reset once or twice because you don't have a potion, that's really bad. So it, it it's a notorious bad gym. It's very, 
difficult, yeah, Brock, especially in regular attempts. <laughs> absolutely. Yeah, like, like I said, I mean, this game's already pretty brutal, and like, I don't know, you're sitting here trying to grind out the manip, you finally hit it, and then you just gotta like, go through all the gauntlet that is the Brock split, and it's just like, ugh. So I do think uh, Amoeba got a rat. I don't know if Bane got both, but I'm pretty sure he got a bird at least, and so did peasants. Um, I'm not sure if any of them got all three, but yeah. You know, and also, yeah, I'm not too sure um, with peasants. It might just be an Australian thing. Hopefully it can uh, clear up here soon. We'll see. Yeah, he's definitely a little choppy. So if you don't if you don't get a cutter and a flyer on the way up, um, you have a few options. Um, route three is going to be one of them, and then um, the route right before Cerulean is the other one. The problem is is that you, the chances for what you to catch what you need it goes down a little bit percentage wise. So mm -hmm. you can run into situations where um, you just get you know cutters over and over yeah. again with when you need a flyer or, or sorry Pretty sure that flyers was a one percent for amoeba i'm not sure but it, it might have been a one percent um yeah amoeba does not have bubble so definitely saving for shammy here and and this fight is like it's just naturally gonna be more scary i feel like with no with no bubble especially in like a race like this i don't know yeah um again critical does a lot and right. poison ticks will do two with level 6 and 3 with level 7 mm -hmm. so the max damage that he can do to you is 12 so you could just I mean critting, getting crit is just usually really bad um, yeah. and like and again, and one of the big things too with tackle and bubble I mean obviously tackle can miss bubble cannot miss so that's another just benefit of bubble I don't know if we said that but yeah and you do save a turn you don't have to tail whip um so to be to be honest with you, this is pretty sketchy. I don't know if Amoeba got the second the forest potion, but let's see. Okay, so yeah, this, this is kind of scary. Sticky. He I've seen him do this before. He got insta poisoned, and he may have to use the other potion. And that's just what I was talking about before, which is why the forest potion is so valuable. Because if he keeps getting string shot at or a poison sting here, he may have to heal again. And that could cause some real issues with the gym. Um, he can still make it. I think he needs another, he needs, another he needs, string yeah, shot. Yeah, he needs a little bit of help. He needs to but, crit or high roll. Okay, okay, he's getting there. So in in theory, he's fine here. If he doesn't miss tackle, he doesn't get crit, and they, the, the, and you don't get a 1 in 16. Or I guess just not... Okay, okay 1 in 16, 16. <laughs> but okay, 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 we're good, we're good. Yeah, we're good, all right. He's so, through, Bang is on. That's... Bang has bubble, so you're going to see his fight go a lot differently because he has bubble. Bang just gets a nice clean win. So Not poisoned, but it's all good. It's funny, I just talked about the Force Potion and then Amoeba almost needed it. Oh, Ooh. there's a Pikachu from... Uh, level okay, three. That's level 3. <laughs> um, Pikachu's pretty rare in the forest, but if you get a level 5, it, it will be speed tie, so you can't escape sometimes, and it has Thundershock, and it, is ha it, it happened to me last year, and it's really bad, because you get all the way back to Mom, and yeah, it's it's... It loses you a ton of time, so it's just mm. it's one of those meme things that can happen yeah. in t the tournament. But yeah. so luckily, Amoeba didn't have to use the second potion. Um, yeah. So he's good. he's good. Um, but again, it's always nice to have two. Um, also, for the reason that a, a lot of times, if you have to heal on the Onyx, if you get crit after you heal, then you if you have another potion, you can just heal again, but if you don't, then mm -hmm. you just, you're just dead for the most part. Um, yeah. But well, Amoeba definitely... Down saves for these pushing the M right here, this fight is horrible. Yeah. But, Everyone uh, definitely should. Um, unless you're like full, if you're like full health somehow, then it would probably be fine, but you can also get looped into uh, sand attack misses as well. Um, yeah. So runners try to aim to get torrent for this gym, which is um, one third of your health. Yep. to increase your water moves. Um, when you have Torrent, the Sandshrew is a favored two shot here. When you don't, it's an unfavored three shot. So it does have Scratch. I mean, it does get Scratch. Oh, one in 16 Ooh, Scratch. Wow. That's, oh, that's say. oh, that's brutal. <laughs> and I was just about to say, like Bang and Amiba are brutal. very like even right now and they both have one, so. 
Peasant's so, still kind of getting trolled over there on Sammy. Pretty sure he had to heal multiple times, but he's poisoned, so he should be able to manip his HP a little bit good for better. So that Sancher does six damage with Scratch, except one in six, one in sixteen of one in sixteen of the rolls does seven, and he actually got the one in sixteen roll there. So it's a it's the equivalent of getting crit chance. So that was a uh, he's one in three to use Scratch, and that what well, he was one in sixteen to do seven. So that was yeah. That was like a two percent chance. That was pretty unlike unlucky for Amiba, yeah. um, but that's why you save. You just you have to save on this fight because anything can happen. Mm -hmm. um, okay, so he gets defense girl to, uh, before. So bang bang did take a little bit of a lead because of that, obviously. Yep. Um, I mean, there's nothing you can range. do. You know, he played it correctly. You gotta. No no way! It's just, it's no insane, actually. Way. Dude, this is like what happened to you in practice, dude. That's insane. You got he, another so this, one this in actually, sixteen. Yeah. Does he get the wrong Squirtle or something? Is this like is this like a bad defense? I mean, dude, that's okay. Yeah, it been going for withdrawal turn one on one. Okay, well, so this race got a little more exciting. Um, because uh, Amiba is definitely the Amiba to bring this back, but yeah, that is very, oh for sure, very unfortunate. for sure. Yeah, that's. That's pretty crazy, but that, that that is what makes the tournament interesting, is like stuff like this happens like on race day and you know it's Bang going for tackle Amiibas. and Onyx. This is now a range, open sixteen. Yeah, I don't I, I don't believe in that play personally. Uh, I think yeah, this is no, this is why, this is why you're you're better off bubbling in this scenario instead of weakening with potion because it's just not gonna be as consistent. Um even though yeah. bubble crit is a little annoying. Um, now stalling becomes a little bit more troll too, because you can't really attack the Onyx at this health. Like, yeah, the, the thing the thing with this too is like, there's obviously an optimal way to play this fight to get try to get torrent, but crit on any of these stall turns ruins your day. So, um, yeah, he got he got out of there with it eight, which is yeah. okay, but. He's through though. I mean, being through Brock, it's it, it's such a relief getting past Brock. Honestly, like I don't know, especially like in the tournament race, like it's a little bit more amplified than it is in like a, a normal race. I feel like I don't know. Definitely uh, first round jitters. I would imagine just yeah, uh, you know, just coming in into play a little bit. So what, All that's right, torn so... for 13, but not 14 for Bang, yeah. so we will have to stall a turn. Okay, so Amoeba uh, does... Oh, that's he too bad. It? Well, oh, he got... Oh, like no, it. he missed it. Okay, well, he got double bind miss. Oh, my God. That's so troll. <laughs> oh, my God. Uh, so Amoeba will not be torn for level 13. Um, so we'll have so... to stall a couple times on Colton. <laughs> turn one. So turn one bind miss generally means you win the fight, because even if you miss the range, um, yeah. you... You will get it anyways, so um Yeah, sometimes bind miss is like the nuts, like so good when having some Bind miss is definitely nice turn one, but when you get it when you're going after stalling, it's horrible, but Yeah, true. Um So one thing to note as well for the next fight that they do, um which is kind of a very low key um Tackle miss from Onyx. Oh ta oh nice, okay. So peasants should be through then. Um, okay. yeah, he got one in 16. 16. Yeah, okay. Wait, nice. is that a 116 with six defense, Brash? I really don't know. I'm like, I, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I, I don't. I think it does two to everything. So okay, makes sense. Um, uh, so they're gonna, the runners are gonna be getting some items now, some potions, some antidotes, some awakening, some repels. Mm -hmm. Um, some runners will opt to do what Amoeba's doing here, which is sell Rock Tomb to buy some more potions, some more status items. Um. Because again, you just want to get through, and oh, running out of potions or anything else is really bad. So, um, absolutely. So they're gonna. So Bang's coming up on Colton here. Um, yeah. Peasant's gonna have to stall a couple times on Colton as well. But all past Brock. I'm pretty sure all three have one. Looks like Bang has one. Um, I'm pretty sure Amoeba has one as well. So I think all three of them are. You know, what is this? All within like a minute and a half, two minutes of each other, so. With Bang and Amoeba being pretty close to each other. Um, so, Bang, what? Stalls right here on this Caterpie, hoping for tackle. There it is, and nice. Now you're just chilling, because now your torrent 
What now he's torrent for no he's not torrent for fifteen, but he gets it for fourteen. So your HP uh, IV determines um, for level ups whether you get a plus two or plus one or plus three and um, twenty seven for example, which none of these have, is a plus three for fourteen and makes it really difficult because you want to have torrent for fourteen because this next trainer has uh, a Kakuna and a Metapod that don't die in one hit. So um, this fight can go really bad um, if you get poisoned by the Weedle and or crits or any of those combinations because as soon as you hit one string shot you are going to be slower than all three of them so you're just going to lose a turn each time so Am I crazy or do peasants just like randomly just skip to this fight? Am I like crazy? Because like now he's like kind of ahead of Bang now or am yeah, I- Yeah maybe he's just- maybe his feet is just choppy. Okay, it's okay. The, Austra okay. the Australian difference dude. <laughs> Yeah, I figured. Yeah. Oh, stream is behind, so actually this is like, he's actually in the lead? That's crazy. Crazy cool, we are in for a... Ju he's second, okay, cool. We're in for a juicy matchup, like I said, I mean, I I knew this, this race was a low-key sleeper. I, I don't know, just felt it. Yeah, but looking at their HP, I don't think Peasants is good HP right now. He is not. Stalling on this... Uh, I don't know. Uh, stalling, on, stalling on this yeah. is kind of like whatever. I mean, you can take damage, but... If you don't take damage, then you literally can just like fight Rocket, like, kind of comfortably, I guess. I mean, I don't want to say comfortably fight Rocket, but... I ain't getting trolled on the pass. Okay. Yeah. Um... Yeah, so... so what does he do, do now? Do you, think, do you think he fights Rocket, or do you think he just... Well, I personally... If he needs a slave, maybe? Yeah. Or HM, buddy? Uh, let's, let's see what happens. Okay, he doesn't need one. Um, well, he's not... So technically, he's in 1 in 16 Hyper Fang range, being 6 yeah. defense. Um, I personally don't believe in Rocket. I think it's too risky of a fight to do in a race. It is you do have a revive, but it also you also don't want to burn your revive this early. Um, so I would do Hiker, but that's just me. Um, yeah, Hiker's just Omega save. Like if you're ever in doubt, ever worried. Oh, is that a one in sixteen? Or am I crazy? Dude, imagine if Zubat could learn fly. Like ironically, like yeah, that is weird. So man. nice. It was a one in sixteen. Okay. So or not a one in sixteen. At one percent. I'm sorry. 1% counter. So, if you, if you saw all the runners pick up the Person Berry, uh, it, Person Berry will help you with Confusion, because Misty's Gym has Water Pulse users, which have a chance to confuse you, and they seem to always do, <laughs> um, even though it's a, only a 20% chance. So, Bang going for Rocket. Yeah, He's, but uh, Bang playing the part, doing Rocket. He does he love it, doesn't he? Rocket, man, but <laughs> it's just... So he's not in range to die. See, this is what's this is what happens. You get tail whip, and now he's if, if he does hyper fang, then he's dead. So yep, he's dead. Yeah, I yeah. just every it's time someone does rocket, I just uh, it hurts. It, it, he, yeah. Well, to be honest with you, like even with revive here, he can actually just die because he can get hyper fang crit because you're slower than this ratata, which is part of the. The reason why it's bad. That would be misery. So, the, yeah, technically he would die to hyperfin crit here, which would be okay. He didn't get it, but he got oh, tackle gosh. crit. But I mean, now his HP's good, so he's chilling. Uh, okay, I mean, this is why you don't do rocket, man. It's so bad. He is down his revive though, so that is something to keep in mind. So like, that revive can bail you out in a bunch of situations. So losing it this early kind of stinks, but yeah. So basically, Bang's gonna have to save for everything, and there's there some fights that you don't have to save for the revive or don't have to save um, if you have a revive um, so yeah that's just it's one of those things that like people that like, aren't comfortable doing a hiker like hiker is yeah. just so much better but because what like if you use your revive now I mean whenever you use it yeah the sink is crazy right here actually um <laughs> yeah it's weird uh, but yeah, what? So if you use your revive this early, when do you, when can you even get one again in Lavender Town? So it's like it's so far away before you can get another revive. 
Or is it is it lavender or is it uh Well you can get the is one in tunnel? in Rock Tunnel technically yeah, if you yeah. burn a little few steps, but Yeah. But yeah, it's just it's it's just in, it's interesting to see the the rocket punish, yeah, because um you know, I I learned my lesson on Rocket. I think a, wh a while ago, a this year, when doing practice yeah. races, it's, it's just because yeah. you look at it and you say, well, he's only got two Pokemon. It's it's technically the fastest if it goes correctly. You can get a lot of damage, so you can have easy torrent through 17 and 18, but or sorry, 16 and 17, but it's just not worth it. Um, the other trainers you can do, um, Josh, which gives you speed EVs, has two Rattatas mm -hmm. that can quick attack you. But again, quick attack crit just kills you. So you yeah, have fighting to Josh in a race. I don't know. That's like I would fight Rocket, but Josh, I don't know. Josh is worse. You have to save for Josh um, because again, if any of these runners like white out, they're they're going all the way back to mom. So that's really bad. So that you'd lose a lot of time because you'd have to go through the forest again. But I mean, you could use you could use one of your repels to get through the forest, and then you'd have to yep. get, I guess, buy another one. But um, again, safety is the the key for for races. You you really want to try to be as safe as possible because yep. this game is very unpredictable and lots of bad things can happen. It's and all about finding can... that balance of going risky yeah. and yeah, you know, playing safe. Uh, he getting uh, peasant's getting poison. That's good for him. Bang missing the range, unless he wasn't torn. I think he was. Yeah, he was. Yeah. So this this fight can be kind of troll. Um, yeah, the Grimer fight. doesn't die in one hit. Has um, can poison gas you. It, it can disable your water gun. Mm -hmm. um, not the it's not the greatest. Mm -hmm. um, really close here. Also, also worth noting, I believe Amoeba's in the lead right now because he does not need to catch anything, but pretty sure Bang and Peasants both need a, to catch a rat. And catching your rat in this Route 4 grass, like, or your your cutter, like, it always hurts because, like, you're not guaranteed to just get a cutter, where I feel like catching your bird in Route 3 feels so much better than having to catch your cutter yeah. in Route 4. Yeah, I agree. Uh, you, do, you do get a Sancher chance, but... Yeah, as as people know, this is like the Spiro grass. I mean, you see, you get trolled by Spiro a lot. So, um. the good old Jack Spiro. Uh, Bang did pick up the Great Ball. It's an optional um, catching. It'll it'll make the, the the catch way more consistent. Um, oh, I do so. believe is Peasants on Fire Red. I think he might be. Peasants is indeed on Fire Red. Um, uh, it didn't actually affect him this round. Why did he come up with that leaf green wrong? He... <laughs> yeah, he's an emulator. Bang. Why is he fire red? Bang, that, bang I haven't realized that. Uh, oh, weird. Weird. <laughs> yeah, I was thinking about that too. Yeah, he's he's. Oh, he has console. both. Okay, I'm I'm silly. Okay, so peasants is just in lead. But he's cooking. Yeah, yeah. I'm literally just. This race is crazy close, man. Honestly, like going into this gym, everybody's like within like thirty seconds of each other, like. Yeah, I mean, honestly, well, Peasants... Is, nickname is Sancher here, though. Will he do it? Peasants has been grinding, man. I mean, he's done a lot of races with me oh, and Wanley so and, and Chippy, and um, he's uh, he's been pretty solid. I think his mid-game needs a little bit of work, but... Um, and his E4 needs a little bit of work, but he's been... Yeah, he's been really solid in these races, so... And, you know, yeah, so this is a lot sure. more even than we thought. Um, again, Amoeba obviously being the, the favorite of the race, but, I mean, dying twice to... Liam yeah, uh, definitely yeah. sets him back a little bit. Um. Yeah, Misty, like, Misty can be such a swing fight for time. You can lose so much time on Misty, and, and then the fight immediately after that, you can also just lose an insane amount of time. So, like, no lead is safe, especially with these next two fights coming up. Yeah, so um, Amoeba and Peasants will obviously have to revive for this fight, so most a lot of runners will opt to save here, um, which... You know, it's kind of slow, but uh, it's not likely to kill you. And if you have the revive, you can usually win the fight. But again, confusion and crit can weird things can happen. So um, the way this fight works is that you're outsped by both Staryu and the Starmie. The Staryu generally likes to harden turn one. Sometimes it will go for Water Pulse turn one, which is pretty bad. Uh, but again, the name of the game is not getting is dodging confusion. Um, the star is not going to use anything else besides harden and pulse. He will, he will always pulse turn two. 
So um, what? Peasants should be seeing Swift, right? Oh, absolutely, yeah. Peasants okay. is going to be favored Swift here. Um, based on his defense, defensive, special defensive combo, mm -hmm. um, seeing Swift nice is obviously good. Miva. He's going for the range, and Got he gets it. a crit. Nice, man. Miva, All right. Miva going for it as well. This is it. I won. Ah, oh, it stinks. Yeah. So now this is kind of a sticky situation because like you're in crit range and like this isn't like okay that was a good roll but my fav the worst thing is whenever you miss the range again after she heals like that's the worst. Yeah, that's pretty unlikely, but yeah. And then again, crits crits on any of those turns and you're it's just it's GG. Mm -hmm. Um. But yeah, it's it's nice to have a Squirtle that with Persum that gets through. The, um. True. And it has Swift being be favored, um, because if that Starmie's spamming Water Pulse on you, um, it'll usually it'll get three off usually. So that's uh, it's fine, and that's what the person's for. But yep. again, you, you you can use the person later, um, and you can obviously get confused twice. So it's it's you generally want to keep yeah. the person. Um, yeah, going into Rival 2, I mean, this fight's really bad. I mean, majority of the time on this fight, you are forced to hit a Mega Kick for your life, like, literally every time. So, like, that alone makes this fight one of the worst fights in the run, in my opinion. But... Oh, yeah. Yep. Um, I don't know. We'll see what happens. It's a, it's a little bit of a complicated fight to play correctly. There's a lot of weird ways to play it. Um, you uh, The thing is, is you obviously, you can't heal too high. Is his special defense? Is this a ten or or thirty? It's ten. Just... Oh man. It was, he, he's he's range. He's right? range. He's yeah. Deal. Oh, he's just he's going for the flinch. Oh, uh... imagine. Oh. <laughs> no. Oh, it stinks. Don't die. Oh. Oh, it stinks, man. Oh. Oh man, yeah, he, he wasn't really ready stinks. for that crit. That yeah, yeah he sh yeah he should have he should have bite there. He got he probably got a little nervous there, but yeah. Um, you can go for bite again when if you crit that bite in that very specific scenario. Unfortunately, he did miss the kick and he died. But oh, so that's gonna try. Miba's got to hit this kick for his life. Here's a yeah. good example right now. He okay. hits it. Congrats. And Bang actually was that... in a situation where he wasn't hitting for his life because he tanked a hit from there. But but very nice. Hopefully, take two for peasants goes well. Uh, Amoeba, does Amoeba heal here? Maybe at a quick. I mean. Probably I mean, not, probably. But... I mean, I, I don't know. I, I would. This is a little too low. Um, I was talking about from this. Okay. <laughs> he got one in 16 quick attack, Again. too. <laughs> yeah. Amoeba's the one in 16 man today, dude. We've seen a lot of those in this round, like, between these guys. Peasants lived it this time. I guess he missed. Please hit. Oh, oh it stinks, man. So, unfortunately for Peasants, um... This is one of those things where his his inexperience in the game is 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 showing a little bit on this fight, um, yeah. whereas the other two runners have a lot more experience with this fight. Yes. Um, yeah, it's just it's it's a shame he didn't bite a second time there because he'd be so far in the lead right now if he did. Um, yeah, that was such a swing, a big swing of time right there. But I mean, Bang and Amoeba practically synced at this point. Um, yeah, Amoeba's definitely gonna have to heal for the next trainer, without a doubt. So, uh, this this is why like running a good Squirtle is a big deal because uh, uh, Peasants is is actually just running the worst possible Squirtle for Rival Two. True. Um, you're taking seven to nine from Quick Attack and seventeen yeah, to twenty point, from Vine yeah. Whip. So, I at least for Squirtles that I run, I always generally try to have at least sixteen defense and twenty one special defense so that. You take the least amount of damage in this fight, so it gives you a little bit of flexibility. Because um, you can run into situations where you're in range of stuff a lot, so... Hopefully he hits this, it'd be pretty Please, bad if you die three games. times. You don't do it to us. Okay, okay. thank goodness, he got there. Um, okay, so Amoeba is going for the potion before the Oddish Girl, which is a good- which is obviously... You have to, I mean... You're only 1 and 8 to die if you miss the kick, and then 1 and one and 2 to get Absorb, but... Um, mm -hmm. You definitely can't risk that. What, what's nice about this too is he actually can go for the bite now instead of the kick, which I don't know if he will. Yeah. It is kind of a safety strat, but um, I, I personally he... love just biting here. Like, oh yeah. yeah, obviously, like hitting the kick is just obviously straight up faster. But like, if you get the flinch, I mean, it's 
it's still pretty fast. Like it's you're losing a couple well, what, seconds. What, to just what you're trying to do again? You're also trying to get Torrent for level 25, and it, with true. with his health there, he didn't have it. So because if you you want Torrent for the Raticate trainer in a little bit um, after yeah. this split, so because um, that fight can go pretty badly too. And also, like, yeah, if they were doing late surge, that would come into play a little bit more as well, but since they're not, it doesn't really matter, but there's a little bit different strats where if you're torn, it can be pretty helpful for the last fight on this route. Or, yeah, on this route. <clears throat> I do not mind the safe dam passes, honestly, like... I don't know, it, this really hurts just hitting him. Yeah. And it's so um... avoidable. Yeah, for sure. There is that. There is definitely a, a safe, consistent pass. It is a little bit more harder on ex execution wise, um, but it is safe to just double bag manip. Um, even though you're only one in sixteen to get hit, but it's just yeah. unfortunately um, gives you a little bit of consistency if you happen to have torn for twenty five, because then you can pulse the the first oddish instead of kicking it. But yep. It's just a time loss. Um, hitting an extra trainer is just always going to be slow, even if it's just one Pokemon. The exactly. experience doesn't help you at all. Um, yeah, bridge. As you'll see, as you'll yeah, see in the next race, there, um, yeah. ahead, there's bad. a little bit more. There's a little. These guys are doing early surge. Um, you'll see yeah. tomorrow that there's a different route, slightly different route, um, which gives you a little bit more flexibility on this split to not have to hit Mega Kick, um, mm -hmm. as well as what trainer you're able to hit. Um, to get that experience you need. Yep. Okay, Peasant's going for Kick there. Yeah, I didn't. I. I mean, it's. Ha it happened to me last year, so I, I never go for Kick on this oh. thing. There's two in a row. Yeah, it's just. Dude, he's getting so trolled. He's missed like four kicks this already. I'm pretty sure. One of the things. See, one of the things to note for um, racing versus um, regular any percent glitchless attempts is that. For any percent glitchless, you're going to be doing what's best because if you die, you just reset. But for a race, you got to get through it. So yeah. certain safety things need to be done and should be done because you're not going to get the best luck in a race every single time. Mm -hmm. So yeah, that's what like, racing. Is. Racing's pretty fun, like for that reason, like that. It's you're kind of getting a different run every time, and it's just nice to and fun to you know see different scenarios and different things that can happen throughout the run and different ways to get screwed over and yeah I, I would say racing is a very good thing for practicing the game because you get to see the whole game you get to adapt to weird situations mm -hmm. um because a lot of times for any percent glitches especially doing this for the, the route they're doing you don't get past surge very often um so if your mid game is is really rusty then um, you're not gonna. That's why racing is it's in late game too. Same with E4. Like you, you want to be practicing everything. So, yep. um, yeah, racing is a uh, racing is it, it's it's a unique challenge compared mm -hmm. to regular attempts. Um, because again, you you gotta finish. It doesn't matter about PBing. You just want to. Oh, okay, man. that that was not as. I don't think that was a safe pad. That looked like a turn I, frame. I kind of agree. I think there, he, I think he accidentally pretty. turn framed, or he meant to. No, no, you know what he did? He meant to turn frame, look, and not go, so he could yeah. double bag manip, and then he instead just turned. He just went because so he yeah. pressed right too hard. That's what happened. Yeah. So unfortunate. Um, yeah. Unfortunately, this trainer is. He's very fast. I mean, he's literally a one turn fight, but um, yeah, unfortunate because him and Amiibo were within seconds of each other right there. So that does give Amiibo a nice. Not a big lead, but he does, you know, gain good time. But Dan's what, yeah. like 20, 25 seconds, maybe? Yeah, yeah. Okay. You gotta run around him, too, and he does the exclamation mark, sees you, and then it's a super effective text on the on the drowsy, and mm -hmm. yeah, it's, or not drowsy, yeah, slowpoke, but yeah. I would say overall, RNG-wise, um, it's definitely, uh, been pretty bad for for most of the runners in this run. That, oh, yeah. That's but that's what everybody's makes had their fair funny. share of like, yeah. That's what makes race. It can be that's so makes fun. It can yeah. be so frustrating at the same time because like, you know, you could be sitting over here getting completely trolled, but somebody's over there just completely just cruising along. You know, nothing crazy, sitting all their moves. Yeah, it, it's just fun. I don't know. Can't really like 
my my last couple races in practice have been really lucky all the way through to rock tunnel and then i just know that like tomorrow it's like if i got a feeling like you're, you're not gonna get the same luck like i burned it all out so you know but you know it'd be no, nice you're really you know? consistent though yeah you're, you're very consistent so uh you know it, it comes happens, with the route yeah 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 i mean again that's what i think as runners of the in the tournament and you know you want to be try to be as consistent as you can obviously mm -hmm. you can't control for rng um you can adapt well and and do safety strats um as best you can but yeah you know sometimes yeah, you just yeah. die you know it's just part of the game um pretty sure amoeba hit both his kicks there by the way and then bang missed his first one hits the second so you're gonna see a divergence so of the true, two I routes think. um the early surge runners have to get the ether here because they are going to be a lower health for boat rival compared to late surge runners. Yeah. Um, so you they need you need you need a kick you need kicks for um, drowsy potentially the Raticate trainer if you don't have torrent, and then you need you need a kick for the Ivysaur, yeah. and then um, the Raticate generally if you don't have torrent. So yeah. um, I did think it was a pretty cool strat. How um, I mean I didn't really think about it, but yeah, but. Uh, with the late surge runners just get, grabbing the ether anyways just because yeah. like why not like if you want it's a little bit more safety obviously at a top end like grabbing that's just time loss but i mean it's very nice to have in the back pocket to like not really have to worry about oh if i miss a certain amount of kicks i'm you know losing to, like whatever yeah it's very um, nice to have that safety blanket of just having more kicks available to you uh, and basically, that comes into play with a, 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 a certain strategy that you get to pick for, for um, Lavender Rival, which is using Mega Kick versus using Pulse and Bite with specials and uh, X attacks. Um, mm -hmm. And the backup for that is if you happen to get to Celadon with not enough kicks, you can. There's a Max Ether you can pick up, but if you have one already, you can just use it. Or, or a lot of people will use it um, before the Oddish Trainer. Um, just so you don't run out on that fight. Yeah. Um, so, because because one of the most one of the hardest fights in the game, uh, Martha. He misses a kick. Yeah, Martha can be pretty. Uh, it hits that one though. Pretty sketchy, especially low, when you're low on mega kicks. I've done so much late surge. I gotta react. Yeah, yeah, to that's, what that's, what route, you know? yeah that's what I'm thinking. <laughs> like too, yeah. Um, all right, so Amoeba's got the lead here, heading to Vermilion. Uh, movement is a huge deal in this in this route. Um, True. A lot of times really you're going to be pretty perfect close. Movements. Yeah. Yeah, you're going to be close to to optional trainers a good amount. Um, okay. But runners that run the game a lot are confident in their movement and the the timings of the movement. Um, yep. But obviously, you don't want to hit optional trainers because they're useless, and you, if they're avoidable in the regular route, then yeah, you know. So yeah, this route's pretty like it's pretty convenient that you get six tiles of one percent grass because in this route specifically, the optimal movement is to take six tiles of one percent grass. Yeah. So like, it's just very convenient that it works out that way, and because it works out that way, you're literally just one tile off. If you go down instead of left, one tile like literally. Um, just get hit by a trainer. Very unfortunate. Um, yeah, but like you said, I mean, once you've done it enough, it kind of just—it's kind of just—I don't know. So this Camper Jeff trainer uh, can be a little scary. Um, if you have Torrent, he one shots with the with Water Pulse on that Raticate. The problem again is that he's got Quick Attack, and technically Amoeba could have died to Quick Attack crit there, um, which can be really bad. He does have Revive, mm -hmm. but. Um, yeah. It would if you die here, you set it's gonna send you all the way back to yeah. um, Cerulean. So doing this shop here, another difference slow. in the routes. Um, Bang uh, also did, did not take this. Yeah, yeah. You get your paralyzed heals. You get some super potions. You're gonna need the super potions for boat rival and for surge. Um, Bang also did pick up the citrus berry, uh, which is a unique item. It's a little out of the way, but it does make does help on surge. It basically gives you an extra okay. turn to try to win. Um, I, I, Ami Amoeba is definitely when I did the practice races with him. He definitely is playing very optimal, and 
not super safe. He's not doing. Mm -hmm. He's not going to be doing a lot of these lum strats, citrus strats, etc. Yeah. Peasant went um, for the save for this guy. So peasants doesn't. This is actually smart. He th doesn't. Oh no, this is before the drowsy trainer. Oh, yeah. okay. Maybe he doesn't have revive at this moment or something. He 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 does not have. No, he does not have revive. Um, okay. I would. I would almost consider saving for Jeff, not for this guy, because Jeff can... Yeah, that makes um, sense, though. You're close to Cerulean here, so it's not the end of the world, but... Um... Need to enter in this fight, this fight, Rival 3, we're kind of just jumping fight to fight, but it's going to yeah. a fast pace. Um... So, um, Amoeba is in Vino range here, so um, yeah. he opted to heal turn 1 of Ivysaur rather than potion before the Pidgeotto. Personally, um, I've never been a fan of like post super potioning. This is my obviously I know everybody yeah. likes playing it different, but I always oh, like just healing before the fight. That was actually pretty wow. Uh, that should die to bite. So I agree. that would have been. I don't think that was oh. over. Oh, we missed it. Oh, oh wow, Amiibo's okay. getting wow, wow. <laughs> okay, uh, Amiibo just got us. Amiibo got such a sick fight there. I mean, he missed yeah, the, was, the bite. Yeah, it was a little yeah. f too. It wasn't enough mm -hmm. on crit there. Um. But yeah, not getting double status there was definitely really nice. Um, yeah, like I was saying, like uh, I personally have always been a fan of healing before the fight. I don't know, just like it's grown on me too. Yeah, yeah, for just sure. getting leech seed sucks so bad. Like, like it's actually it's just way worse than getting sand. I feel like I don't know. So again, the, the way that the AI works is that when your health is above half, it it tends to like moves like sand attack or leech seed. That aren't necessarily damaging there moves. It is. Bang! Did get yeah. Just like what you like, said. Even if you get past this, like you're still going to be in a really sticky situation. Yeah. Forces force yeah, them bangs, to swap. I don't. Mind bangs this. in a great. Is bangs not in a good spot here? Um, mm -mm. Also, no he revive should, for bang at this moment. He should be able to. He well, he'll just he can just he's got supers, so he's okay. But ideally, he flinches um, his hit. Flinch it. Another seed. Oh. Yeah, bang might just be resetting here. Yeah, I don't know. He needs to, he needs to hit this. It's not really an option. So, okay. okay. So now you have to super like now well, he, or he, something, you, right? No, you 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 you'd pulse here and then super on the Kadabra. Okay, he's opting for but This is also fine, I guess, right? Well, then he's got to kick it and he's True, you're yeah, 100% right actually. I would have I would have opt for the consistent confusion, but th again, see now he's missing kick. See, this is one of those things that like you there's so many situations. These fights are so complicated. He can pulse he now. I don't know why he's kicking, but yeah, okay. Yeah, I definitely should have pulsed there, but at least he it. got through. So now he's going to oh, have to... Is... He's in cadaver range, I believe. So he's going to have to... Let's see. No, uh, okay, I think it's yeah. 12 to 15, actually. Nope, it's not. He's no. dead. Okay. Oh, yeah. That hurts. Again, it's 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 a it's a runner. It's a it's a knowledge thing. You you gotta have the notes up for this fight because you gotta know. If that was you're one dead in sixteen. Like, what was that? I think that was. Yeah, I. If that's I one in sixteen. That's actually. I have so to check the notes. Ridiculous. I think that's twelve to fifteen. Which, if it is, that's really unlucky. Um, for Bang, he, technically he did do the right thing. If it's twelve to fifteen. Um. Sixteen max. Pretty sure. Okay. 16 max? Okay. Yeah. Then he did or take just, a risk. Or you just take, yeah, or you take the safer approach and just heal on Kadabra. I mean, there's also that option too, but he went for the more riskier play. I don't mind it, but at the same time, it was kind of risky. Uh, see, the thing the thing that I noticed, oh, Bang is dead. Yep, Bang's dead no again. No way. Oh yeah. my. Dude, that situation, that's like one of the worst situations you can crit. Like, that's yep. so, that's so, that's such an unfortunate death, man. Yeah, and Peasant's got Leech Seed as well. Um, so still very so close Amoeba's to got a comfy guys. lead right now. Yeah, Amoeba's um, definitely comfy right now. Unless he, unless he has Surge issues, yeah. Um, now, something, right. again, something to know. I can keep an eye on these guys if maybe you want to keep an eye out on his Surge fight, maybe? Yeah, sure. Okay. Um, I was just going to say that, like, this is one of those things that if you get caught up doing any percent glitches attempts versus races, you tend to make incorrect plays in a race setting. That was the correct play, but you should always opt for being safer because, again, there's no reset button in a race. You they, you can't. I mean, you can re, if you save, you can reset, but you want to you don't you want to avoid redoing fights, which is what's happening with Bang here. Yeah. All right, so Amoeba's starting the the uh, Both search guys fight. Ivy Sora finally. 
That's good. Um, Pezzis should, is gonna have both to these heal. guys should be through the fight. Hopefully he knows to heal. Okay, good. Potion is not right. Okay, good. Super potion. All right, Amoeba. Amoeba did outspeed the Voltorb and get the and get the range. Okay, turn one Thunder Wave. Um, can be kind of troll. It's better than double team though. Okay, no double teams at all. That's weird. And there's a crit. And then Ooh, there you go. Wow. That's my that late early just, surge is bad. He literally just headshot. Oh, and then, wow. Dude, this this race there's is so one. entertaining, man. All right, both these guys are through rival three. Oh, finally, though. God. This um, is just this is a shit show, man. These it's guys are basically synced though. though. Peasants and Bang practically synced. Yeah. So that's pretty hype. I think these I think Amoeba got close. crit in his first practice race with me. I when he came back, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Oh uh, man. Yeah. This is. This is a uh, this is pretty uh, this is, pretty this interesting. This is definitely a race of all time for these guys. Yeah, this is it's been very back and forth and very yeah bad. Uh, yeah, true. Bad That's RNG. a good point by Anna. Like sometimes you can get really long dr like dragged out deaths on the ride too. So like it is kind of obviously he died, so that sucks. But it was a very fast death, like relatively speaking. So generally speaking, he's gonna yeah, be yeah, favored yeah. to use double team here um, mm -hmm. when you're when you're not in shockwave range. Ah, oh, missing the first one's really bad. Okay, so he's got to hit through two, two double teams. You try to you hope for confusion. You hope for confusion here. He hit through. Now he's got a mega kick, and this is a mega kick through two double teams. Hits he got it. it. Wow. There you go. Oh, nice. He does okay. It. The nice. Mad Second lad. try. That's pretty. Um, that's pretty hard. Um, again, the, the the thing to note there is if you miss there, you're in shockwave range, and you are slower than the Raichu, so he would have to swap both pokes out. Um, super yeah. potion. And then, you, then you'd have to hit another mega kick. Yeah, it's the worst is doing all that, and then just ended up dying anyways. Like that's that's he, the long yeah. dragged out surge death that we were so, sub fifty about. with how bad the RNG was for Amiibo is pretty pretty good. Um, um, but yeah, I, like Amiibo said in chat, never swap. And there is there is honest honestly like, I guess yeah, in a race maybe might be yeah. better. Yeah, true. Um, Fair enough. Yeah. One thing to note though is it. Uh, which is what makes Sandshrew so good in early surge is that you can swap your Sandshrew in to tank a shockwave because it doesn't affect it because it's ground, which mm -hmm. will save you a turn. Um, from it'll save you from having to swap an, a second one in, which is kind of nice. Yeah. Um, so Bang does have a Sandshrew here, so if used correctly, um, if he gets unlucky on on hitting Water Pulse and Mega Kick, mm -hmm. he uh, he can get through this fight. So. Yep. Um. Peasant, peasants and Squirtles pretty bad. Ten is yeah, this is, not, is great not great for Surge. Yeah, like this is. I mean, I d and he has high HP, so that is like one thing going for him right now, I guess. But definitely not a great Squirtle for for Surge. One one thing to note as well for Peasants is that he got. You see, he got Thunder Wave there. Um, not great, and that has to do with your speeds. Your speed stat. You're a coin flip to lose to be outsped by that Pikachu, and then he can use. He can use uh, Thunder Wave, which is just time right. loss, which is why better speed is usually better. Um, okay, so Peasants got through cans, and now Bang's still struggling on cans. So I think Peasants Bang is... checked the wrong can on this. Oh, he, he probably yeah, he probably checked the same one. He or checked something. he checked the top left one. He needs to check the one to the left of that. I think. Okay, maybe he got a little confused. It, it happened. Yeah, there's, yeah. there's 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 no there. no there's absolutely. Yeah, I mean yeah, it's absolutely. All right. Okay. So, so or it's under, I guess. Right. Okay. So, where is it? <laughs> oh my god. Wait, what happened? He checked. I, I don't know. I'm so confused. I don't know where the he, first can is. I Maybe I'm very, very under, silly. I think he forgot where. I think he saved in front of a can that's not the right one. So I'm not really sure what's going on with him. Um. Okay. So peasants got turn one thunder wave as well. So Peasants just needs to hit it's a Mega to Kick left. through Thunder Wave. To the left. I'm pretty sure it's the can to the left of the can he's looking at. Now Peasants gets it. through. There you go. No damage taken. It's to the left. I have no, no idea what's happening with Bang. I've got it's no clue. It's to the left. He didn't check it. I. It's, yeah. This is a puzzle that doesn't get screwed up very often, but Bang's obviously pretty nervous. Um, again, the way that cans work is that um, when you find the first switch, it's going to be in an, in an adjacent can. Um, and that yeah, can be multiple cans man. or just 
or just one depending on um, where you find it. That's why you save and reset. Um, there's something something weird's going on. I I, I don't know. I, he's I he's missing what, one. I don't know what's happening. I don't know where it's at, man. I'm losing my mind. Where I think is it's, it? I think it's. I think it's. Um, Dude, uh, this is so unlucky. What's I'm happening? Like, I don't know. So I know what happened. I, th I think so it is saved, middle, right. So okay. he saved above the top middle can, right? So instead of checking, you know, one to the left, I think he just got a little bit confused and then checked two well, to the left instead. And then when he came yeah. back in the game, he didn't realize that he did that and he just not checking the one I'm you know what it, you know what it probably was he probably got the switch and it was near the the gentleman and probably did the gentleman and before forgot, you know which yeah. is what you're supposed to do and then forgot which one he checked so. there it is yeah oh and he's not well i guess yeah i guess he's yeah he doesn't need to save um if you sure. if you if you get the can before the gentleman um you don't have to save again which is kind of nice um but yeah, bang, bang, pretty far behind here. Um, yeah, definitely got to. That would, that would, dig himself that would be my one. guess. My guess would be that a lot of times, if you're near the gentleman, again, Absolutely, you want to do yeah. the fight before you save, so that you don't say, same thing, so you don't have to save on surge again. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, if you, as long as you if you forget where the can is that you you know use, then yeah, that's not great. Um, yeah. All right, so Amoeba, Amoeba's. Uh, Amoeba's entering oh, it's still Tunnel very, here. very unfortunate that like it still took him that long to find the can after that all was, that uh, bullshit. So I don't think I've ever seen that before. That was uh, that was interesting. Um, so actually, yeah. maybe he does have a better to here. explain it than me, but I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Um, you you want to you want to maybe explain how the advancement works for this first round, maybe? Yeah. yeah. So. Okay. Um, the way that the way that round one works is that Isn't first seen. place and second place will advance. Hang through as well, by the way. And then it's going to be the two best third place times um, of the six remaining people. Um, mm -hmm. We did unfortunately have two forfeits before the tournament started that had joined already, so um, the, I would say the chance of advancing with third is is higher. Um, but you still have to beat out two other third place runners in order to advance to the second yeah. to the round to round two. So mm -hmm. um, it just makes it so that um, again, it's not you don't have to win this race. You got to get at least second, and then if you if you happen to you know be in a very competitive race, you want to get a competitive. You want to be have a somewhat of a competitive time compared yeah. to other people. Um, Peasant's so. getting very troll, by the way, on uh, Alicia right here. Like he's. Like Bang's honestly like catching up a little bit because how bad this fight's been for him. Yeah, Peasants has Missing definitely a missed a lot of kick. Yeah, yeah. He um, was at nine total miss coming out of both. This is a so. this is actually a, kind of a weird, interesting strategy. I think he's keeping the paralysis because so he can't get status, but he's also can get fully parried here. But honestly, uh, feel really bad because Amoeba just fought Martha, and I did not pay a lick of attention to it. But yeah, I guess it's yeah. to Martha. <laughs> We're just baffled by the cans thing <laughs> for Bang. <laughs> I still am kind of uh okay. He hit times two. Yeah, um, easy. So despite Amoeba's, where's Peasant's going? Would... Where's he going? Uh, does he not have Barry heals? Maybe. Oh, he. Oh, maybe he. He maybe he ran out. Uh, because of. Yeah, he had to have. Yeah, wow. Because he's missed so many freaking kicks okay let me think so yeah maybe he got he used one on surge because he got yeah and then uh, one on alicia just now yeah maybe he got two on alicia then yeah that's that's really unlucky see see that's why um what amoeba did opted for was sell rock tomb and that allows you to buy four uh well actually no that's not that's not that never mind um yeah paralyzed heals is the least how did he get back? Did he? Or he didn't jump the ledge, right? Yeah, he must. Not no, no, yeah, he didn't jump the ledge. Thankfully, he did not yeah. jump the ledge after Alicia. Um, hey, well, Bank could actually gain a lot well, he, of time here by just simply hitting. By the way, but maybe he should have just maybe he should have just centered. Actually, what would I do yeah. here? Well, actually, no, you're losing three turns, but you got to go all the way back and cut the thing and buy. Yeah, yeah I, I don't know. Or maybe he forgot to buy them. That is also a good point. That oh oh, so he kept the static from surge the whole time. Okay. No no, no. I did, I think he might have just forgot to buy. I don't know. I I just do not know. I'm pretty sure he just had to use a bunch because if he forgot to kicks. buy them, then yeah. If he forgot to buy them, then he's had static through that whole Alicia fight. That's why he. 
Oh, he used three. Okay, yeah. I, forgetting the body, that that wouldn't make sense. He's not. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. exactly. That's, okay, you yeah. If, if you here. burn para heals like you know on Alicia, that's pretty bad. Well, at least his HP can get back to a decent spot now that you're poisoned. Um, what was I saying? Um, I was thinking of something. Yeah, there. I think there's been over like. I think there's been like at least 15 kick misses between these guys. This, which is pretty yeah. crazy. <laughs> Yeah, um, again, we, we've got a few prize pool donation incentives from uh, myself, Ananan, Chippy, um, I think one other person, but um, I think Ananan's on Mega Kick Misses, so uh, yeah, we definitely got a good amount here. <laughs> um, uh, rip that guy's bank account after this tournament. Yeah, I I, I, I picked, I did, uh, I did $5 for every Blizzard miss, so I'm going to see how... Uh, how that goes, but uh... <laughs> luckily you don't have to use Blizzard as much. Thankfully. Yeah, and especially These since um, most um, m Erica is the the big Blizzard fight um, because yeah. you don't you you don't get to use an X accuracy. But a lot of a lot of runners will opt for the safety strat on that fight because it's Blizzard's only seventy percent, so. Uh, but Blizzard is 93% with accuracy, which is why. And a lot of times when you need it to hit that 93%, you can die if you miss, so it's pretty, uh, yeah, it's pretty bad. This is kind of some tight movement coming up for me, but this is some of the hardest movement in the game, honestly, doing this part clean. Yeah, um, it's a lot of, it's, it's timing, um, and this is the first race of the tournament, yes. Uh, you get, you do it so many times, you get used to it, um, it's, it's like, audio cues and, and visual cues and I mean because again you only get that little circle of light so um, the biggest again the biggest thing for the tournament for the racers is not hitting optionals that's like the number one thing actually that's the number one like new runner thing I would say is like if you start playing this game the most important thing to do is to like to have a decent time do the route you know save when you need to save but hitting optionals is just pure time loss it doesn't it doesn't help you at all so and it can actually screw you up in certain situations. So yeah, true. Um, and there's a lot of optionals you can hit in this place. So um, it's better to yeah. just play it safe and you know. All right, Amoeba's done with um... Amoeba's the rock panel. One hour. Yeah. Twenty minutes. What's a okay? What's a viable world record time? Fifty, fifty-five, fifty-four. Okay, so he's yeah. Something like that. Yeah. Yeah, so his, his pace is actually like picked ten, up a like, little bit. It's like, I think, what, like, ten and a half minutes from... from Surge, so, like, yeah. Yeah. Um... It's either so ten and a half say, or nine and a half, I don't remember, but... Uh, I mean, Amoeba had a pretty good Mar Martha, um... So I would say outside of, you know, obviously the Liam deaths and the Surge crit death, um... Yeah. Amoeba's having a pretty decent run. still 206-ish pace is... Yeah. Pretty nice considering the things that have happened. Um, but yeah, I mean, this race is still pretty close between these guys um, on the top. Peasants fighting the guy with Machop. Is that is that Lenny? Is this Lenny? Oh, okay, so just... so Peasants actually does yeah. the uh, the pulse effects route. Um, oh, okay. You could believe it, even though it's kind of an ancient route. Yeah, he he does. Yeah, the pulse I mean, yeah, that is, yeah. It's been a while since I've um, looked into that. But yeah, that makes that makes complete sense. Yeah. But it is it is going to be a little more consistent for early surge, but it is obviously slower. Um, which is again, I, I was telling peasants, I was like, you you really should because we he, we did I've done a lot of races with them, practice races. Like I was like, you really should learn late surge because you know. Um, yeah, I but, agree. Like in my opinion, like if you're going to learn this game and like you want to like, you know, you're just kind of wanting to play the game, learn the route. Like doing surge late is just going to benefit you so much more and like. It's really not well, going to make that big of a difference, like especially when you're just starting. Like I don't know, like and you're going to have a much better time. Uh, I would maybe. say for for beginner runners too of the game, um, like if you join the tournament and you just you did no any percent attempts at all and you just were doing races, I, I would not start with early surge because I would say early surge is definitely a route that requires a little bit more experience in some of the fights because mm -hmm. especially the surge fight can be really complicated and difficult. Um, to make the right decision sometimes to survive. Um, 
Uh, Amoeba is in the hideout now, or he's in the casino right now, about to go to the hideout. But his HP is in a good spot. You kind of want your HP. So yeah, we, we, we were kind of sidetracked, but you kind of want your HP coming out of Surge to like... You want your HP to be good for this little section coming up. Like, obviously it helps for the Rock Tunnel split a little bit, but for this split specifically, it helps a lot more if your HP is uh, pretty good coming out of Surge. Yeah, so basically after Surge, you're going to slowly start taking damage. Little bits of damage here and there. Um, that's you, you can take damage from the, the slow pokes if you get poisoned from missing kick. Um, quick attacks here and there. Um, you take damage from the Arbok. But you want to get... You basically want to get into the sweet spot of having Torrent for the for Giovanni 1's Kangaskhan because it makes it a two-shot. Um, if you don't have it um, and you're close to it, then you run into situations that are kind of scary because... Yeah. But what's nice about Giovanni 1 is he doesn't have smart AI, so it basically does random things. So if you happen to be dead to Mega Punch, it's not guaranteed to use it. If it was, then you'd have to heal a, a lot on that fight. So... Yeah, true. Um, it just kind of does random things. Yeah, it can be really um, troll because sometimes you could, it's a three hit KO, but sometimes you're dead after turn one, or like turn two, for example. Or like, it, it can just get put in such a tricky situation. It's just very awkward. I would say you either want Torrent or you want to be as far away from it as you can, or not super yeah. far, but like, because what can happen is a lot of times when you're really close to it, like if you're one health off, uh, Kangaskhan has a move called Fake Out, which it can do True, before yeah. move before you, and then if it Fake Outs you into Mega Punch range, it also it's, it it flinches you. So um, then you basically yeah, risk true. the next turn getting hit by Mega Punch, right. which is uh, yeah, that's a that's a is way that to die. Is that normal fighting the right guy first? I really don't. So the right her, guy, her. the right guy first. Uh, actually, it, this only this only matters for um, late surge, to my knowledge. Um, Basically, um, in, in in the late surge route, you you when you don't have torrent for these Ekans, it's a range. So what happens is you do you do the right hiker sometimes when you're leveling out of torrent for the next level, because mm -hmm. you fight it first and then you level. Um, so you get you keep torrent for that Ekans. Whereas if you do the left one, you'll level out of torrent before you get to the third Pokemon. Okay. Um, so. Mm -hmm. Oh, he gets he misses the range, but no, his, no damage. Hit his kick, so he's about to be getting out of rock tunnel. Um, Bang is one trainer away from getting out of rock tunnel. Yeah, I don't know why Amoeba did the bright guy. It doesn't really. I mean, you lose a step, but it doesn't really matter yeah, that yeah, much. Yeah. But... Especially if you're in torn, it really doesn't matter at all. Let's see if he goes for the bite here. This is not the you get greatest range. Directly after these two fights, oh. yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, well, so the Ekans range is better, I guess? The Ekans not guaranteed? I just really just don't remember. It's been so long. No, it, no, it should be guaranteed with, with, with early surge. Okay. Yeah, it's definitely, anyway. it's definitely guaranteed with, without, even without Torrent. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. I remember, I, I remember, would... like, I remember this exact situation, because, I mean, but I remember, like, I did use Thunder's Notes, or I still use his, but... I remember always wondering why you would do that, but I remember Pogia told me to fight the left guy first. No, from that point on. But I've done. Alright, so Amoeba's gonna be using two of his candies to yep. um, level to Blastoids. One thing to note, just a reminder to all runners that are watching, um, what can happen a lot of the times if you're not careful is that if you happen to die to Martha or you happen to swap um, sometimes your cursor is not on Blastoids, and if you if you don't if you rare candy, not Blastoids, it's it's like almost a DNF, so it's really bad. Yeah. So you always want to make sure when you candy here that, that you're on Blastoids. Um, so yeah, because uh, that's yeah that's one one that's one of those things. There's a couple things in the, in the run that can happen that like are almost DNF you or like cause you serious like logistical problems and that that is definitely yeah, one of them candy, uh, yeah candy the wrong poke is yeah it's pretty devastating i don't know if i ever done that in this game but i definitely done it in sapphire so i remember i think i think bang did it in a i was either a practice race or he did it in in the tournament i don't, I, I think it was last year but um 
pretty sure of it. Um, okay, so yeah, so Giovanni fights. So so now um, Amoeba's on, Amoeba's at a good health here. Again, you like I said before, you don't want to be too close to Torrent without having it. Mega Punch here. Okay, there you go. Nice and easy. All right. His HP is very nice for the next fight. Yep. You can just post in to be at solid HP. Um, yep. So peasants is through the poster guy, and then Bang is sending to the hideout. So Bang is still very much in this with peasants. Like I'd say, like it's pretty much a toss up right now between who's going to win between these he, guys. Yeah, he's so, about a fight and a half behind. Um, yeah, and I would say Amoeba's probably around five, roughly five to like five to seven minutes ahead, maybe. Yeah. Maybe All that right. much. I don't really. I'm just you know. Oh, grabbing so, this first. Okay, so this is yeah. This is like part of the pulse route. Is that you grab this, this come down here and grab this candy yep. first. Um, you. This, it is a little bit slower, but it makes it say. I don't know when you candy before this fight. Next fight. You maybe? candy after the next after this next fight. Yeah, because you get and you get, get thirty three, and that no, you don't. You get level thirty five, I believe, and then you level from thirty five to thirty six from the two trainers. Interesting. Yeah, or maybe he, maybe he, ju That's another maybe he just got 33. Have. Yeah, okay, yes, 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 I am correct. So you do before, yeah, not after. Okay, makes sense. So, so you, you level 36 to 36 after the Arbok, probably? Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. Um, this, this does guarantee, um, if you have Torrent, the range on uh, the Arbok, which is kind of nice. That Arbok can be a little troll because it can uh, poison thing poison you, it can glare you. Um, it's not great. Um, Okay, bang, going real safe around that spot. Yeah, taking around it that safe. I, I honestly respect it. Grabbing this nugget. Um, just gonna let him afford some more X items, make it a little bit safer for himself. Yeah, so you missed it, but Ami Amoeba, um, yeah, so Amoeba did the shopping for the the rest of the run. Yeah. Um, you get a bunch of specials, and you get an X accurate, or X attack, some X accuracy, some guard specs, some X beats. It'll light a lot, it should last you the rest of the, of the run. Um,. Yeah, I kind of wanted to so, see what he did for shopping, but I should be able to see here in a minute. Yeah, this in this so menu you just teach potion, potion here. Yep, yeah, repel you, and something else. You want to be around forty health for this next fight, um, just in case. It's a Persimmon still. Did he need to do this or no? I mean, I guess with this route, maybe you knew. I don't really know. But with least surge, you can actually keep you, you need Persimmon berry need on. It. Okay. Yeah. Um, Makes sense. Yeah, that's something cool with the late surge route is that you can actually keep the Persian Berry on there, and that could uh, come back to save you a little bit later in the run whenever you fight Sabrina. But maybe nice you don't need it. I don't blanket. know. It, it, yeah, I'm not oh, sure anyways. Well, there's. I don't think it's optimal to like. It's better to just do it there. I think, but. Yeah, yeah. Uh, peasants one fight ahead of Bang. Bang will be on this fight shortly. Uh... Oh, that's yeah. So he didn't he didn't need it for Sabrina because he outspeeds. Yeah. So yeah, you could you could if you didn't outspeed Sabrina, you could keep it keep it on. Sure, and then sure. Yeah. You'd have to equip it later. Yeah. yeah. So big um, thing for this fight you want to avoid is getting crit by quick attack or gusts. Um, you can just water pulse ooh, the yeah. Cubone. Okay. Oh my God! Wait, is he, is he doing spec shots right now? No. He's he's okay, okay. I would not. Yeah, I was like slightly paying attention. I was okay, like, yeah, so now, one. now these mega kicks become ninety nine percent accurate. Um, so you you so Ekman, you you equip the black glasses before Viridian Rival, because the Growlithe eh, is a range without the black glasses. Um, obviously, if Amoeba misses kick here, it's pretty bad. Um, having extra X items and revive. Let's you kind of salvage some situations like this um, if you happen to miss here. Um, hmm. So this might be torrent. Okay, so I like this play, Amoeba opting for Water Gun instead of Mega Kick. Technically, it's faster to Mega Kick, but again, if you miss the one percent really, there, you, yeah. you probably are going to die to Ember. So um, it is definitely better. Um, you wouldn't do that in regular attempts, but for safety, yeah, you, you don't want to die after all that setup and all that stuff, so. My headphones came out of my computer. Oops. <clears throat> yeah, definitely nice to be past Rival. Feels good to get past that, because, I don't know. Most people will... Because you're just start instantly thinking about Koga immediately after this. Yeah. 
most people will not opt to save on that fight because it is very unlikely for you to die. Uh, again, you gotta miss 1% mega kick or get yep. last turn quick attack. You'd have to get quick attack crit like twice to, you know. But he, but if, if you did get crit and you, because he does have quick attack, um, you can um, you can heal before you go because if you are guaranteed quick attack, so. That does mess with the Gyarados a little bit, but you you can work around it. So that's yeah, just what number, experience yeah. comes from. Yeah. So. So yeah, peasants had the menu, or he already did his menu, and Banks still has the menu. So I, I forgot about that. Um, peasants did say for this fight again, he doesn't have any revives, so he kind of is forced to. I feel like like there's no real. Yeah. Um. Judge. I mean, wants to die to this fight and come back. It's crazy. I I think what I would have probably done is sell the nugget and buy a revive. Yeah. Um, but, because again, the Nugget is an item that doesn't get used in any percent at all. Um, and it's just in your bag, so use it to buy extra X items. And you can actually pick up a second Nugget for even more safety and buy even more revives and more X items. But, um, yep. yeah, this is a close one between Bang and Peasants. Um, yeah. no Amoeba is nice. Amoeba's pretty far ahead, a couple minutes, I would say, at this point. Oh, yeah. Amoeba's um, casually, or not casually, he is very solid first pace right now. Like he could lose minutes and still probably win at this point um, yeah there are there are a couple fights that can you can die multiple times to um, yeah koga definitely. being one of them agatha being one of them um yeah. it's but still I think, very much a toss up between the other two runners for sure like, these guys are very close these guys are definitely within like 30 seconds of each other i think amoeba just wants to avoid situations where he could potentially dnf so um, yeah, definitely. That yeah, that when you're in a lead like this, that's definitely how you want to approach it. Is just how can I go as safe as I can to just not die. That's pretty much all Amoeba needs at this point. Yeah, but like you said, there is those the unavoidable. Yeah, like you said, there is those unavoidable fights that like literally are just like you could just die over and over, chain die to them. Yeah, but that's why <clears throat> good racers are gonna know when when to save, when you have to save. You know. Yeah. Exactly. Um, because, you know, even on certain fights, like, for example, um, even if you have both pokes alive and two revives, you can still wipe to Koga, which did happen to Ananan the other day, and that was pretty epic. Um, it happened to me last year, that kicked me out of the tournament, where I, I had, yeah, I died twice with two revives, which is pretty, on Koga, it's pretty unlikely, but, um, mm -hmm. sometimes you just always gotta save, um, yep. so, I would say, you know, Amoeba probably doesn't need to say it. He probably should, but I mean, even if he died to Koga and had to and died twice, he he'd, he'd probably come back and probably still be yep. fine. He'd be full health, sure. but which would be kind of bad. But yeah, so um, it looks like Bang gained a little bit more time here, but it just um, peasants opted to get the T early, and that's actually slightly less optimal. It's not that big of a deal. You just lose a few steps, but um, yeah, Bang didn't get the T yet, so it looks like he's gained a little bit more time, but. Uh, peasants will gain that a little bit time back later when, when Bang has to get the T. That is. Yeah, I think peasants is probably the only one that's doing both early surge and pulse pulse strats. It's it's pretty uh, pulse strats don't really get used very much anymore. Um, it's interesting he opted to do that combination for the tournament, learning yeah. the game off the bat. But um, mm -hmm. it still is nice to see brand new runners of the game playing the game because. Um, I don't know, I yeah, feel like we don't. We, I feel like we don't just see brand new runners as much nowadays. Maybe I'm crazy, but I mean, I think the speedruns a really great speedrun, especially when you first start playing. I mean, the biggest hurdle is obviously the Squirtle manipulation, but yeah, um, getting if you can get through that reasonably yeah, okay. and play safe, you can. You know, I know. Like, if runs. I can do it, anybody else can do it. I promise. It's just, it's fighting that initial like, I don't know. Like everybody had that feeling like whenever you first wanted a speed run, like you get over that initial hump of just like starting, you know, like once you start, like I swear that's the hardest part is just starting and then yeah. getting yourself into it. Yep. Um, but as you can see, just the fact that we're able to have a racing tournament means that the speed run is viable to like complete, you know, it's, it's not, there's some games that are like not great racing games just because lots of weird stuff can happen mm -hmm. and you can DNF, you know, but for this game, um, it's pretty straightforward. If you save properly and do safety safety strats, you know, yeah. um, unless you make again, there's some like I said before, there's some mistakes you can make that um, can make it 
impossible to finish, but yeah, it's pretty unlikely. So, um, it's looking like a one seventeen, like forty three, one seventeen forty two. All right, I say down this. Real quick. I say this all the time about the speedrun um, when I do attempts and stuff, but um, I personally love the speedrun because it's one of the only speedruns that there's only one manipulation and it's in the very beginning and and once you get it then you don't have to do anything else any no frame perfect tricks none of that stuff yeah. like early, later on in the run so mm -hmm. once you once you can hit the squirtle and if and if you can hit the squirtle then you you can you're yeah, playing absolutely. a really really great speed run um absolutely that is that's that my i think a lot of people can agree about that too like this this game the fact that there's only that one manip you have to hit makes it a lot nicer to run even if the manip is pretty annoying sometimes, but like, it makes it a lot better that you don't really have to worry about you know hitting a one frame trick or whatever four to I mean, five. You, frame you, you trick know you know one thing about like, that. Yeah, you know you know a lot about that run in Sapphire. Yeah, that's that's I've yeah. I've not run Sapphire. Um, maybe one very, day. Very very yeah, crazy. Did Bang just miss one percent kick there? Uh, I guess so. Yeah. Yeah, I think he did. <laughs> yeah, he did. Bang yep, is getting them $10 all. $10 from Anna. And dude, Anna has just get bled dry today, dude. Maybe with a nice clean <laughs> pass. Yeah, I would say, like, I was talking about some of the hardest execution earlier in Rock Tunnel, and I also would put those biker passes up there with some of the hardest execution in the game. If you want to do yeah. it optimally, that is. So basically, the way the bikers work is that they spin on frame cycles, and um, Ooh, when you get up to the, the first one. Unlucky. <laughs> when you get up to the first one, you have to burn a frame before you can s open the start menu and go. Um, obviously, you can do the safe pass, which is just opening the bag, and the bag will freeze the spinner. But what can happen is if you get up to that first biker and you haven't burned a frame, when you open the start bag, he can technically s move and hit you when you go. Um, it's a very and it's very hard to react to because even if you do it perfectly, if you burn the frame, when you go to open the bag, the spinner can look up and it, you have to react to him doing that because he does have a chance to do it and then you have to react accordingly. So they're very scary even when you do them perfectly. You have you still have to react really well. So, um, but that, that that's that's probably the most one of the most advanced tricks in the run. So Absolutely. I would say most most runners don't do it unless they're super confident. Personally, I. I don't really like doing it in races because, I mean, it's just, just no you lose point, a little in my bit. Opinion, to risk, like, yeah, losing. You lose a couple seconds. Like, you lose yeah, a couple, couple seconds. seconds or lose minutes. Like, what do you want? Yeah, for, like a minute. Yeah, maybe not yeah, a minute. Because you know, a lot of well, the other thing about that with that too is a lot of time you don't have the 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 PP to like oh, true. fight yeah, those like, trainers either. So, <laughs> um, depending on what happened, you might be low on 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 water pulses or have zero, yeah. and that's yeah, that's not good either. So. Um, safest thing is the back minute, but Amoeba's a pretty confident runner. He likes yeah. to do thing op things optimally, but um, but even the even the even the best runners of this game, you know, still hit those bikers once in a while, you know. Yep. So absolutely, it just it just happens, and yeah, then like, you get like nerves you said, involved. Like, and... like a, literally, literally, like a, it could be a frame of a difference, like your pause being a frame earlier or something. That's, that could be the literal difference when you hitting a trainer or not. Oh, Poker guy was able to find a pretty consistent way True, to yeah. burn that frame, which is turning you turn the bike up and face the fence before for, before the top biker. Um, but again, it still comes down to you have to react if he happens to quick spin in the direction that you're going to be doing the pass. If you if you go too fast and you don't react well, you can just actually just run into it. So yeah. which is everyone's done. So, um, but it's one of those things that you, if you're a top runner of this game, you, you get a get a get a save and just practice it 50 times and see yeah, all the weird really? spins they can do and. Um, but in the grand scheme of things, especially for a race, it really doesn't matter. Like you're, if you do the the safe version, you only lose a couple seconds. Yeah, like so. a million other things are gonna decide this ra <laughs> a race besides that. Yeah, that back pass. I promise you. I would say if you're a top runner and you're frustrated and you're behind, you know, you probably will would probably consider doing it. But, um, but again, it's one of those things. Like, if you know it's not going to be guaranteed safe, which is, or I mean, it is guaranteed safe if you do it correctly. But yep. if you get a little nerves going and then you are worried about messing it up, then that just it just makes it worse. So yeah, yeah. it's really not that bad. But like, 
whenever you're on pace, it makes it, you know, it amplifies it by so much more, so. Now, obviously, if Amoeba hits an optional here, it's with his lead, current lead, it's not going to matter, mm -hmm. but. Yeah. Um, yeah, Amoeba doing the optimal pass here the as cool, well. The cool advanced tech. Again, so for that one, you got to burn. You have to burn two frames. Okay, he's not saving. I mean, Amoeba can. He's got such a massive lead. He can kind of just. Yeah, do I think whatever. he has I mean, two revives right now. He has a huge lead. Yeah. Um, again, this fight is going to be a. I wouldn't even. I would honestly say this fight's much. This fight is much worse with this route than it is with the other route. Simply because yeah. of the Kangaskhan, or not the Kangaskhan, the Louisiana being a way worse range. So, Six and sixteen to die on this, this fight one shot. Yeah. So this muck. And this muck love is does, too. Yeah. He doesn't get one shot by the surf, even with torrent, and he likes to use minimize, which lowers your accuracy with surf to seventy five percent. So um, he can also do other random things. He can do acid armor, which basically does nothing. Um, he can sludge you right off the bat, which again, sludge poison, you you just die, so that's really bad. And then obviously, if you miss after minimize, he's gonna sludge you, and if he sludge poison you, poisons you, it's it's really bad. Yeah. Um, Going for the bite, I don't, I really like this easy yeah, easy yeah, fight. There you go. And that, the funny thing about minimize, actually, like later gens, it changed because it would make if it was like if minimize was how it was now, like it it uh, raises your evasion by what two. Or whatever like whatever that is like it, it changes it by two instead of one so it makes it much worse uh in later yeah. gens so it'd be so annoying if it worked <laughs> that way in this game yeah um one 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 bigger big change about uh both actually the pulse route and late surge is your level 42 for the for that fight um, which gives you a little bit more flexibility on sludge damage, um, and it also makes the range for yeah. surfing that wheezing um, 11 and 16 versus 7 and 16, uh, or 6 and 16. Which so it, it's it's it which is another advantage of uh, late surge um, versus early surge. But um, yeah, Amoeba gets a clean fight, no minimize, yeah. or, sorry, no miss on minimize. Can't, can't ask for it to go much better than that, especially no, no race, poisons. So. Um, there is there is kind of a there is a niche safety strat for um, that you'll see a few runners probably do that especially on early surge um, you can get you can get what's called the lumberry which basically cures any status problem um, if you equip the lumberry on that fight it increases your win rate from on that fight dram dramatically um, because even if you get sludge poison the lumberry cures the poison so. Um, it helps your win condition a lot. Um, mm -hmm. Okay, Amiibo good to see. About good to see he's running. Ahead of bang right now, by the way. Seven. Amiibo. Oh wow, seven minutes. Seven minutes ahead of Bang, um, and a little bit more than that over Peasant, but it is within like thirty seconds of each other between uh, Bang yeah. and Peasant. So very much anybody's race from this point. From yeah, I mean, I, I, again, it I, does matter too. Like you definitely want, you know, you want your seating, you want to be a better. Better seed, well, second so. second does advance, so um, it, this is uh, a pretty tight uh, match between Bang and Peasant to see who. Yeah, that is a good point. Yeah, like getting third, you're not guaranteed advance here with third, so you're definitely still trying really hard to get a best time as you can with third place. Yeah, so and I'm not super. I'm not super familiar with the the other pot three runners, um, their yep. racing times, but um, I would say in terms of a race time. Um, I mean, for pot three, it might be might be different. I, I haven't seen a lot of the pot three runners do a race besides peasants. So yeah, fair um, enough. I know peasants does has gotten to two ten. So um, mm -hmm. I don't know if he's I, he's the, he's definitely not on two ten pace here. So, uh, but we'll see. I, I would say historically, um, getting a under a, like a two fifteen usually will get you through. Um, yeah. When you start getting to 215 to Amoeba 220, said he was on like this scary. was like 20 minutes ago, but he said he was on like 206 ish pace. So if he's on 206 ish pace, that means these guys are probably on like what 212, 213 roughly, give or take. I'm not sure, but so Amoeba doing the questions. Um, mm -hmm. You do them incorrectly. You got to fight that trainer, <laughs> those trainers. So I don't. I don't uh, think I'll ever forget A B B B A B. 
Yeah, yeah. Ever, yeah, ever. You'd have to really oh, space I'm... out, but... You, you, you know what's a funny one that I always do? Did one too, so... What is that? Uh, what's funny is I always do for the Sabrina puzzle, I always, like, double check and triple check, like, top left, bottom left, bottom left, down. Oh, like, <laughs> even though I've done it a thousand times, like, that's, that's, yeah. like, another funny one. Okay. Bang getting the revive. Okay. Hopefully so, the, because of a... Man. Yeah, yeah, that's gonna be a big swing between those two. Um... Although Peasants is gonna have the advantage because he's doing he's doing pulse route with so he'll be level 42 so he'll have an advantage against the Weezing compared to Bang. Um, but this this fight, especially in glitchless attempts, is horrible and a lot of really good a lot of really good runs have yeah, died it's actually this fight. Pretty, it's yeah. sad actually. A lot like of my great runs have died. <laughs> oh man. You're not uh, a true runner until like you've lost multiple like good paces to this right, because like it's definitely gonna happen to the to the best of them. Like it's, when, it's just when, unavoidable. Like I don't know. Like you're yeah. all, you're eventually gonna die to COVID. It's just gonna happen. Like like when you when you don't even get mad after dying to Koga because it's just you just kind of almost expect it at this point. You know, like when you die to something like unfair. You know, like you know yep. last turn swift crit on Starmie or like triple confusion or something like. But Koga is one of the yeah you're even though it's really like if you do the math on Koga it's you're definitely favored to win but you just for some reason Sludge even though it's a twenty percent chance to poison just loves to just proc that twenty percent chance over and over again you know especially when you're on a good run so you know every time you get hit by Sludge you just hold your breath hold your breath basically and like oh and you just wait for the text that says you're poisoned and then it's over you know yep. Um, so so Amiibo, yeah, Amiibo got through Blaine. Um, Blaine's he pretty does simple, have... especially with your speed. You don't have to worry about anything. You can just yeah. I was just gonna say so yeah because he's got 31 speed. He outspeeds the Rapidash. Um, I can't really see it. Is Bang Bang's running 24 speed right, or is that 29 speed? I think Bang has 31 speed, and then oh, 31. Uh, okay, has it... 25. Okay, so Bang should be fine for. Uh, and actually, no, because pe peasant speeds doesn't matter either because he'll be forty-two. So, um, true. Good point. Yeah. See, yeah, so, that, that yeah, it all comes full circle now with the, the speed. Yeah, which is actually sort of nice. Um, the the pulse route is nice in, in 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 the way that you can run lower speed because because you're higher level for um for Blaine, and then obviously, yeah, the increased win rate of the wheezing range for Koga. So. Um, yep. But at the same time, like if you're going for safety, you really should just do late surge, you know. <laughs> but yeah, literally, I mean, it, make, we'll, it literally just makes all these fights in the in the back half like so much. Not all of them, but the, some of them that are bad, it just makes them so much better. Like Koga is better, Surge is better. Like like that, I'm just that's just a couple, you know. Like there's so many more that are just better because of late surge. And like, don't get us wrong. Like, you you, you won't really f you won't find any top runner is PB for regular attempts to be late yeah. surge. But it's just in a race, it's just it's just different. So, um, yeah. As uh, as Sai said in chat, um, yeah. When Bill talks to you after Blaine, you have to say no to going because if you don't, then he takes you to the island, the Sevi Islands, and oh, um, getting back is tr kind of tricky. Um, Okay, All right. Thank, okay. Bang didn't get poison. That's good. Honestly, he rare deserved sight. that. After, after <laughs> he the did. Yeah. He's been through this run. Yeah. yeah. All right. Peasants on the muck. Uh, crit also, for the fans. Close. Crit. So he got Ass Armor. That's great. Though. That's the best um, move you can get from muck. Critting that muck is is probably the best crit in the game. I mean, I, I think some runners would argue, uh, top runners would argue, Santru is the best crit in the game when you can actually one shot it because that well, lead Santru is horrible. Santru or muck. Sanctuary or Muck Crit, yeah. Muck Crit is the nuts, man. I don't know. Yeah. The Weezing Crit is also the nuts, but it's not even that nuts because you can just kill it naturally, so like it doesn't feel as good. But I mean, for top for top runners running like regular attempts, the Liam Liam Sanctuary kills a lot of runs. So All right, I don't so, know. Yeah, there you go. I, maybe the Lapras or Dugong might be better. On I don't know. We'll see. Yeah. Yeah. La Dude, Crit Crit flinching the Lapras. I mean, my goodness. 
Um, we don't know what happened, Lovesick, for Bang's cans. I think what happened is, my guess is that he, um, when he found the first switch, he went and did the gentleman, and then saved, but then he forgot what the first switch was, so he tried a bunch of cans that were not close to the can that that was near the first switch, so... Yeah, Bang, I don't know how much time Bang lost in cans, but it was, it was definitely significant, but... Um, he's caught up, a, he's caught up a, a little, a decent bit, but, um... Again, he's he's just competing with peasants at this point. So, um, oh, I I didn't okay, I didn't see amoeba. Did amoeba amoeba must have gotten those both those blizzards? Yeah, wow. Yeah, wow. <laughs> um, so what you want ideally is you want to have torrent for this fight on Erica. Uh, it allows you to surf the victory bell, um, and then a lot of runners, especially in races, will do uh, a strat where they X special on the Tangela, which then allows you to surf the Vileplume. But if you don't have torrent for the for the um, for the the victory bell, then you either have to double blizzard or you can X special on the victory bell, and then you just got to heal a status item. But um, yeah, once again, Amoeba just going for the optimal uh, play and it, and it paying off, you know, which is yep. which is which is how the pres pres practice races went too. The same same exact thing. Which is definitely a one way to play the races, but it doesn't. It can pay off really huge, it can, you know. Or it can punish you. Or it can just destroy well. you. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Yep. So. But if there's a ray, if there's a round to really play like more freely, I feel like it is this round. But. Yeah. All right. So once again, if you sell that pass from Amoeba, that's a, that's another one of those frame perfect start flash passes. Um, Again, when you get up and you open the bag, he does have a chance to walk down. Um, and if he walks down, you have to stop and not go. But if you do it fast enough and correctly, um, you can get past him um, without him hitting you. You don't want to hit that trainer. That trainer has five Pokemon, and they're all beefy. Like, it's basically a wipe, so you definitely don't want to hit that guy. So if you want to be... I mean, you'll see Peasants and Bang will, will definitely bag manip that guy. Um, Amoeba's just got a little more experience uh, in the in these passes, so he's confident in the start flash pass. Yeah, that scientist is one dial yep, vision. One dial. Mm -hmm. I think Poke Guy figured out like uh, a different way to pass that guy, but um, that that comes from going on the out on the the top ends, but. Um, He has gotten yeah. hit by that 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 way too, but yeah. <clears throat> yep. Let's see if Amoeba opts to do the the two X act fight here on Rival. Maybe not. <clears throat> uh, yeah, for sure. He's 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 definitely is. Um, he's told me that he does go for double X act. Um, uh, double X act makes it so that you can't miss Blizzard. Um, also makes this turn right here very scary. Yeah, again, what you want to avoid is critical critical hits from the Pidgeot and bad turns. Um, if he got crit there, he he would have survived, but um, he would have had to heal because again that Pidgeot Pidgeot has quick attack, so it will use it if you're in range to die to it. So. So yeah, so pretty safe fight for Amoeba. Um, most runners won't use double x act here. Um, you have to heal to higher than a nor higher health than normal. Again, Blizzard with x act is 93%, so um, you miss Wait, it. Is it turn on... from 93 to 99 or 93 to 100 with two? I believe it's 100. Yeah. <laughs> That'd be funny though if it was, well. Maybe for math or something, it's 99. Right, yeah, I have no idea. Generally, I do not know. I don't. I don't think so. No, because it's it's higher accuracy than, or uh. Yeah, no, I I, I don't think so. Bang through Blaine, very nice. Peasants right behind him. No. I, I think, Bang's lead is see. slowly scratching a little bit here, though. Yeah, he's he's showing his experience a little better than 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 peasants is, but um, also remember that peasants. I would imagine he's done his menu already with his candies and stuff, and Bang still has to do that. So oh oh, peasants is probably top.
Blizzard 2, maybe? Yeah, maybe he's got Blizzard 2, yeah. Okay, so then... He, yeah, that would make sense, yeah. Because mm -hmm. you could avoid a menu. Um, nice 13 and 16 range miss. Oh, I knew missed that one. Yep, yep. Got the um, flinch, that, though, so... I see that right there is kind of troll, too, because you can take damage, like, and, like... Yeah. Like, get put in a weird situation for getting his con, so... Nice flinch, to be honest. Yeah, now Amiibo's at a good health here, where he sh he's going to have Torrent through Giovanni's Gym. Um, if you happen to be high Torrent here, yep. you know, you can... Um, you can opt to X speed if you didn't Carbos. Uh, now he now Amiibo's running a Squirtle that has very high speed, so he doesn't need to stall an X speed on the Venomoth. Um, but if you don't opt for that strat, or you don't run a Squirtle that's high enough, obviously 30-31 is pretty high. Um, yeah. And some runners won't have the won't be able to get a Squirtle that has that high enough speed. Um, which is another reason why late surge is kind of nice because you get. You, you, you don't run into problems as much with lower speed as compared to early surge. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, whereas early surge, you basically need at least 28 speed reasonably to not run yep. into huge problems. Uh, I think Bane's gonna have to potion, right? Because two yeah. candies, yeah, he'll definitely potion yeah. before Erica. So Peasants also did not teach Blizzard, so he's doing his menu now. So Bane's gonna potion. Uh, or he'll, he'll uh, yeah, teach Blizzard, potion, double rare candy. Missed the range, she wouldn't. Okay. Oh, didn't die though. That's back to back 13 special. 16 range misses from <laughs> Kangaskhan. Or from yeah. Amiibo. That, that Kangaskhan's low key, like, can kill your run, which is really, it's weird when it happens, because he, again, he's. It's so unlikely, yeah. What, one in four, and then he has to choose Mega Punch, and then hit Mega Punch. Yeah, well, he can, he can fake out you, and then if you fake out to you. You know, you gotta miss the range, and then he's gotta. But he's not guaranteed to kill you either, like, because he's got rage too, which doesn't do anything really. Yeah, true. You gotta get fake out, and then you gotta miss the range. Yeah. Get mega punch. Die to mega punch. Mega punch has or, to or hit. Or miss the range. Mega punch crit or something. Yeah. And mega punch also one. can miss too. So like, you gotta factor that in a little bit. Yeah. Looks like this might be torrent for Amiibo. Amiibo not messing up the. The puzzle. Top left, bottom left, down. So with 31 speed and having Carbost his um, his Blastoise, he will outspeed the Alakazam. So this fight should yeah, be. This fight's kind of annoying AFK. whenever you have the X speed. Yeah, exactly. Like this fight is. I don't know. It's just low key like. Annoying or ends kind of scary whenever you have to you force the X speed on the Venomoth because you have to dodge the crit because it'll always go for side beam. So you and got you a couple options. Yeah, well. you got a couple options for this fight if you don't outspeed the Alakazam with Carbos, which is um, option number one. If you happen to be high enough torrent where you can tank a Kadabra attack, you can speed on the Kadabra, which is going to be safer but slightly slower. Um, mm -hmm. If you if you are lower, then again that the person item that person berry item that that he got er, that they all got earlier um, that can save you when you get confused by Venomoth. Um, and then the other option is uh, you can get the Lumberry if you don't have the person berry and you have to X speed on Venomoth, um, which is a lot of things that gotta happen. But and again, it's yeah. it's not likely to confuse you anyways, but. This is one of those situations where if you went into the fight having to X speed and you were in cadaver range and you didn't have the person, you should probably save because like you're risking confusion, coin flip miss, coin flip miss, yep. you know. So yeah, but most runners will not need to save on that fight. So yeah, Amiibo now in Cruise City Gym, kind of ironic because the last gym is literally like one of the easiest ones. So was it a dollar? That you were gonna donate Chippy for crits in this gym, or was it? <laughs> so one of the one of the memes of uh, this split is that it's the most straightforward split in the run, where you just use the same move over and over again, and nothing can really happen. The only thing, the only way you can really lose time is is you know biking, you know the menu you do, and then you know biking correctly, and then. Um, and then critical hits, because critical yeah. hits just lose you time on this split, so. 
not a lot, but you know, you if you get a couple, you, that's oh, that's no, a couple bang. seconds. So, oh no. Okay, bang just hit an optional. Um, it's not a bad optional. It's only just it's got one Pokemon. One poke, one turn. One of the more tame ones. Um, there's yeah, obviously some that are Bang's much even the worse, playing field so. a little bit. Yeah, yeah, making it spicy. Um, I don't know. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. It's okay. fine, we're, we're I think. Through we're through. Practically even now. Like, look at this sink now. Kind of close. So one of the things that is... They're gonna high-five. Kind of, Watch this. <laughs> one of the things that's kind of scary about um, this guy is that a lot of times when you... I'm pretty sure Bang, again, tried to turn frame. And again, if you press too hard down... Or in the direction that you're you're trying to just look, you'll move your character. So you want to turn and then bag manip. But if you move, then he can hit you. So a lot of most runners will um, that aren't confident in their turn frames will opt to uh, bag when you're looking at at looking at the um, the wall, and then they'll bounce off the wall. Um, I still just do a turn frame, but um, yeah. For sure. You gotta be. You just gotta I'm be confident. Say for this fight, I mean, this fight. It's just one of the fights, honestly, in a race. Like you kind of have no choice to do. Even if like you double X act, you're still not 100 percent safe to like be fine. I feel like I don't know. Yeah, this is this is one of those fights that like you're only really gonna not save if you're behind and you like need to win the race. You know, um, then you could risk this because you're really only risking two 93 percent or like a crit. It's not likely to kill you, but. Yeah. Um, you know, if you do miss either one, so if you miss the if you miss the Venusaur, you're based you're ninety five percent to die because his Razor Leaf does ninety five percent accurate. So is Bang Bang um, gonna be in Quick Attack range here. I don't know it's gonna do a lot. It's I don't know. Eleven to twelve, okay, yeah, he's, or eleven to thirteen. Yeah, he's fine. It's close though. But um, uh oh, Pe peasants. What? I'm not uh, sure. Maybe I, they were he, at higher HP. I'm not sure. No, no, he missed. He he missed the turn. I I don't know why. But what did he What did he do? Okay, he hit bang. Oh, the bang! Oh, he missed. Oh my god, he had to have missed. Dude. Oh, I, that's five bucks. How is oh, that man. possible? How can one person get so trolled so hard? So. I got this weird feeling, Bang. Maybe Bang or maybe Peasants did plus one. Oh, Peasants is doing plus one strats. I kind of like it, honestly. I mean, it's a little. Well. Oh, it might be part of the route. It's definitely a little safer. From Zan. It might just be the route, maybe the fight the other route. Mm, I mean, it is. It might be no. more consistent. I mean, it's not more. Consistent. It definitely is. It it makes Torrent much more difficult to get. I mean, you can stall yeah. on the on the Nidorino, but. Um, this is what you do in, in round two, obviously. Plus one special, plus one accuracy. It does. It is kind of nice because if you miss the Blizzard on the Gyarados, you, you won't get Dragon Rage and, and die. Um, but the issue, obviously, with peasants is his health. I think is too high. Pretty sure it's too high. Um, which means he's gonna have to. Yeah, he's gonna he's gonna do something weird. I mean, I would say I would special I would special on the Nidorino and then take Horn Attack or Fury Attack or something. But you could get double poison, yeah, yeah. All right, Amoeba on Viridian Rival. Mm-hmm. Another fight that you you know you want to save for majority of the time if you're not double X What is it? Riley Pool says it is others. a it is a route thing. Okay, yeah. Okay, sure. Makes sense. Yeah, we're just not we're not familiar with the pulse route. Yeah, it's yeah been, exactly. It's, exactly. <laughs> nobody really runs the pulse route in regular attempts anymore. But um, I, it, it, for early, it's definitely safer for early surge for sure. I mean, all right. So um, ooh, maybe gets the crit there. Forty seven, man. Jeez. Yeah, this Pidgeot when it you know. Flying save up same type of attack bonus crit definitely does a lot. So Amoeba's pretty low here. Uh, it's pro it should be fine. Um, okay. Yep. So mm. so essence is going for 
the Reno strats, which is okay, yeah. Nice. So now he's got good torrent. Now he's chilling. Yeah, need to the Venus shore as well. So I mean, that's the big thing in this fight: is getting past the Venusaur, Then you can always pretty much win. Peasants, please get the range if you're going for it. He is. Well, I, no, he's specialed, I think, so he'll, okay, he'll okay, be okay, guaranteed okay. there, yeah. Okay, it makes sense. Um, well, Peasants is... Well, he'll level, so I don't think he's in side beam range here, but... Riley Bull make yeah, you make a you make a, a fair assessment. Yeah, I, I definitely agree. I some of the That's more modern a good routes point. are yeah, not maybe we should look into there. Updating yeah. that. I don't know who yeah. runs that, but yeah, it's definitely true. Yeah. That's a good point. Yeah. Because and in my it, it opinion, is... I think one of the I think one of the most the best route that should probably be posted in there is Anan's early surge notes. Like those are it's one of the best beginner routes. Or you late, can, surge, late you surge, can, yeah. That should yeah. be for sure, yeah. yeah. Yep. Yeah, like Anna, like in my opinion, the two routes that should be like posted are the late surge and just which is Ananan's route, and then uh, just a normal Thunder Nodes yeah. route. So yeah, which they're going to be completely different, and one is way safer, and one is way fat, riskier but faster. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so true, honestly. Yeah, people can just blame Ananan when something goes wrong. Fair enough. But just how we just how we blame Thunder for for stuff too, <laughs> for his HP stuff. Sure. All right, peasant starting. It's it's really gonna come down to E4 for peasants and bang, really. So yeah, um, like with how close they are now, like not much can happen. I mean, I guess rival still, but I would say the two most important fights would be the Bruno fight and the and the um, obviously Agatha is a very straightforward, difficult fight, similar to Surge. But the Bruno fight is a very complicated fight. It requires a lot of you got to run that fight a lot. Although there is some more safe strats that are more consistent strats with full restore, but um, that fight can be kind of complicated. Weird things. Yeah, can it's like on, on paper fight. it doesn't seem like that crazy, but like when you when you go dig deeper and you gotta like think about your speed and then oh am I in range to die to hit him on chin or like you know like you gotta think about your torrent for for yeah. once you get through Agatha's first Gengar and make sure you have torrent for the second one and yeah I mean. And then obviously, you know, annoying things like he, he can miss Rock Tomb and he can crit you with Earthquake and um, you can get in Hitmonchan Mock Punch range. It's, yeah, it's it's very easy to just like, you know, go too fast and be like, oh, oh crap, oh, I'm dead, you know. <laughs> yep. Bang, bang gained a little bit of time because of the X speed. Me but doing um, Victory Road. Um, yeah, Good this movement, movement is here. this movement is not too crazy, but whenever you have to do the movement literally tile perfect, or you just start like I don't know if he's doing the repel this way, but optimally, um, if you do the repel properly, like the exact right way, like you literally have what two tiles of leeway to mess up movement or something. Yeah, yeah. But I think oh, you have to do the the safer thing probably in this, but. I mean, I I think I still do. If you do it perfectly with the the optimal less menus. You, yeah. it's two one percentile or two tiles you're, you're risking. Yeah. yeah. So he is doing it right because this is where yeah this yeah. is where it normally wears off. So yeah. Yeah. So yeah, if you do the yeah like you said if you do the movement exactly right you're always gonna have two tiles of non repelled steps at the very end of Rock or Victor Road, which Amiibo will at the at the end here. Yeah. A good turn there. Um, Another yeah. nice part about races is, is when you when you're doing regular attempts is getting to practice this movement um, in a race sure. is kind of nice because um, you want to do it optimally. You obviously yeah. don't want an encounter if you mess up your steps. Okay. Yeah, like um, yeah, like every misstep is another like plus one to, or it's yeah, it's a plus one or two to every step you mess up to extra encounter possibilities. Yeah. No, is Miva spoiling us with the encounter? The chat. 
Yeah, I think so. Unless he hit the op optionals here, but I That'll doubt it. Yeah. The church. <laughs> okay. Close. No. Okay. Yeah. All right, Mimithu. Oh, yeah. Now we're going into E4. I mean, very nice. Very clean movement. Uh, is Bang gonna level out of Torrent? Uh, oh no, I... probably, it's probably close. I, I think it's close actually, but no, I don't think it's. Never mind. It'll be. So it's what one thirty-eight out of one fifty-one. One thirty-eight is what it is right now, right? Like or forty-six times three is what I'm doing. Yeah, uh, he's probably fine. It's close. It's closer though, I and mean, he's definitely at very high torrent. So if you're ever confused if you're in torrent, take your you know the first number, take that forty-six times it by three, and there you go. If not your max HP, if you're below your max HP, congratulations. All right, so Amoeba entering the first fight of the Elite Four, Lorelei. Um, one interesting race strat to, to know is that you don't have to save for this fight if you calc out how much Body Slam crit does. So you, it is, it is a very straightforward, consistent, safe fight as long as you heal around crit. Um, this is one of the slowest fights in the game. Um, Especially when bad things happen to you, um, mm -hmm. you can get super trolled by hail. Uh, I mean, hail's gonna happen for the most yeah, part. Hail's um, one in four every single turn. It's one in four, and if she's a safeguard, it turns into a one in three. So, I mean, but didn't opt for plus two strats, um, which is interesting. But um, they each yeah, this own, is a good I point, Sai Jamie. Yeah, there's <laughs> not many games nowadays have zero uh, mandatory trainers in Victor Road. <laughs> Hell's falling still. These guys are Sean Giovanni. They're good. They're just spamming surf. Nothing crazy happening over there. Not paying attention to the crits. That's all good. Oh, so, unfortunately. Is he in body slam crit range from here? Yeah, Probably. yeah. A after this hail tick, yeah, he'll be he'll be in range. Yeah. Um, so he's gonna have to heal. Protect um, is kind of troll. Because again, if 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 you, it's un not it's unlikely, but if you happen to get body slam crit. You got to redo the fight, and you, you're going to lose three minutes. Like, you yeah. don't want to risk that. So, just. To, mm -hmm. um, but most of the time, um, when you get hail, um, and you don't get flinches, and you take a lot of damage, you're going to be in range. Um, so. Or Chippy's wallet? Is that what we're? Because I was not paying attention <laughs> to the crits. I will admit. Bye bye, Torn. Oh, okay. He did lose it for 50, okay. Yeah. Close, yeah, it was close, yeah. Okay, wait, okay, 62. It actually might be a range. Oh, it, 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 maybe, it, maybe it is a range. So now you just have to heal. No, he no, he was in range of dying to crit. Yeah, he just that ah oh god, dude. It's very scary That's though. Scary, like healing man. on that turn sucks. <laughs> like it, it doesn't feel good to heal in that range because once you get to this HP, she's more likely to go for confuse ray. Um, maybe that's not true, but she feels like she I, goes for confuse ray more when you're high. Three hat. body slams, no para, dude. This this guy is just based, man, man. So that this that HP for this is solid HP. You know, I don't remember. Oh, this remember, is perfect but... for X spec. This is just X spec, X spec, X speed, and he's showing, yeah. Oh, perfect, man. So that so Beautiful. body slam loves to paralyze you, which is gonna make you slower, and you obviously have the chance to fully para, which is which is not great. But yeah, Amoeba is got the perfect health for mm -hmm. the best strat in my opinion, which is. Um, you just go, you X special twice, and then X speed on your last yeah. turn. You can only really get trolled if you if he misses Rock Tomb, but um, this is salt or gets crit, but this is salt. Onyx health. never um, misses Rock Tomb. All right, so now that he's mine, he's he's subtracted your speed by one. So now he's gonna he's he's gonna earthquake every time. Um, that felt like a crit. Oh, maybe he's a little. Actually, no, he is a little high here. No, he's chilling. Oh no, he's no, fine. He's like... fine. Twenty nine oh, is. No, he's fine. Good. He's fine. It's close though. It's close. I think that was like a high roll. He was actually probably. He probably got high roll a good amount there because he yeah. was. That's actually closer than I thought it was gonna be. Um, is he out of shadow punch range after this? I'd assume so. Probably. Oh yeah, for his defense. Omega out. Yeah. Um, the thing to know with this fight is that so he played it correctly. Um, sometimes you can get too low, and that mock punch or that uh, hitmonchan has mock punch. Um, 
And if you're in range of it, he's going to use it just like quick attack. Mm -hmm. So that's like a runners can die to that if you're not careful. So yeah, that's like the fastest possible Bruno you can get. Because there's other scenarios where you have to full restore on the first turn, and then there's another scenario where he didn't take enough damage after the X speed, so he would have had a guard spec. So that fight he got was literally perfect. I don't think you can get better of a Bruno split, honestly. Correct me if I'm wrong, of course. Like, not having to heal before Jabruno or in battle, and then only have to set up three times. <clears throat> Looks like these so, guys are both through rival, it seems, so that's nice. Yeah. Pretty much a poke so, uh, part. So here comes the second coming of Surge. Uh, um, <laughs> Agatha is just as bad. Um, or Surge the second coming of Agatha. Yeah. Um, they like double team on this fight, so generally speaking, um, you have to yeah. you, so you have to, you have to set up an X speed and an X special with torrent. It one shot everything. He's gonna go for double team majority of the time. He can shadow punch you without double team. It's kind of random, but generally you got to hit through two double teams here. Um, yep, there's two double teams. If he if you miss, he's gonna keep setting destiny. it up for a while. Okay, there's there one is. miss. Okay, now it's and every minus. miss just it starts becoming worse and worse. Yeah, every at a certain like, point you got to reset if it gets too crazy. But he's put, yeah, here's a shadow punch. Got to hit through plus three or else he's dead. And of course he pulls it <laughs> off. What a legend! Uh, uh, the mad lad. You Wait, miss when does there, it matter you, if you, you uh, if you how many extra serves do you have here to like use? Uh, because you need one for Aerodactyl, right? Yeah, so, that's like it. Yeah. Um. Well, if you were. If you were plus special, if you did the the risky lance strat, you'd have it. You could technically uh, blizzard the aerodactyl too. But um, yeah, regardless, yeah, that it was very nice to be through Agatha. That's for sure. It's definitely a weight off your shoulders when you get past her. Yeah, Amoeba's had a pretty clean run outside of obviously the surge and Liam's. This has been solid. Yeah, that he had to kill on that turn. Or you, yeah, you guarantee. But you, that's why you say, but you know, you lose time there, but, um... And I would honestly, yeah, like, at this point with, uh, Bang and Peasant, I would say Bang probably has the slight advantage going into this endgame just because of his more experience. Uh, must have to move in a little bit, so maybe he's gonna have to have some extra tiles. I don't know how he set up his repel, but... He should be able to see where it wears off and be able to tell. Okay, yeah, like so I was now... saying, I would just feel like Bang definitely has the advantage in this endgame over Peasants, just purely because of more experience with uh, just playing the game more. So, at this point in the race, uh, Amoeba is past Agatha, so if Amoeba plays very safe, it's pretty hard to die to the next two fights. Um, I mean, you could play Omega safe and double guard spec on... Mm -hmm. uh, on champ too, if you had the help, yeah, you sure. just yeah, you really could like so. Um. Yeah, I, I would, yeah, very late for these guys. I mean, this is um, true. Yeah, well, it's early for Europeans peasants. and uh, Australian. Yeah, yeah, I think it's like nine eight a.m. for peasants or yeah. something. Like what? Almost four in the morning, or it is four in the morning for these Europeans. Yeah. Yeah, I think Bang and Amoeba had scheduling issues last year too, and then they just you add a the Australian to the mix. Or True. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Wait, is he going for bite bite? Or he went for bite blizz blizz? Okay. Seems like he's at a hyper beam range. Yeah, I mean, the, if you got oh, if you have an extra or... X accuracy, which he does. I'd be missing ears the nuts, man. It really is. It never yeah. happens though. Again, he's either gonna bite or um, Dragon Rage. Um, Double X act. Did he, did he double X-Hack? He probably did, right? Yeah, 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 he did on the recharge turn. He used the okay. second one. Nice All bite right. as well. Dragon Rage would have been a little troll there. Probably would have been weird Aerodactyl, but that bite makes it where Aerodactyl's yeah. kind of like chilling. Yeah, well, uh, well, there's also Wing Attack Crit. I think Wing Attack Crit would kill him from here, I think. Yeah, I, I hate saying close. it, dude, but the, it's crazy when you think about it. Like, genuinely think about it, like, 
this this Aerodactyl has so many opportunities just to just murder and destroy dreams and runs, but it never uh, does for some reason. Hon I don't honestly, know. like I, I saw Anna do this one time too. But if you happen to have a free turn on the Gyarados, you can and you have an extra X speed, you, you can just X speed and then you don't even have True. to deal with the Aerodactyl. Yeah. So that's actually yeah another like safety strat. So I mean, it's slow, but like if you were ahead and you wanted to guarantee not die, I mean, you could just set up heal like yeah. three times on, on Gyarados and just make sure, you know, that you yeah, don't you miss Blizzard or don't crazy get crit. Safe. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I didn't yeah. really know that. Um, yeah, it's kind of weird, but that's why in his route, he bu you bought, you can buy uh, uh, six X speeds versus five. In yeah, makes sense. These guys going into Lorelei now. So generally runners are not going to save for Lorelei as long as you understand the max roll crit so you can and you can heal around it so it's not really an issue so he's, you're gonna have to save for the other three fights but runners don't really save on on Lorelei anymore yeah, either gonna be elixirine for restoring and saving I imagine he just saves like I don't know yeah but this lead there's just literally no reason not to like I mean yeah you know, I mean his, yeah yeah, I mean, it, it, there's, it'd be a seeding thing, potentially, but, I mean, I don't know. If, if I got a bunch of sand attacks here, I would consider regards picking again, just because of how, you know... Although, I don't know, it doesn't really matter. He could probably reset twice and still have a, a, a good lead, yeah. so... Apparently somebody got frozen solid and I was not looking. Oh. <laughs> That's unfortunate for them. Whatever that was. Dugong flinch on one screen. It looks like hail list for Peasant, or am I crazy? Uh, it's very nice. Pretty sure he did get hairless. So I'm either gonna go in, gonna go up a guard spec right away. Um, blocks you from the sand attack potential. Double his X speed. Another aerial ace. It's kind of awkward now. Builds up his first yeah. X spec. Gets aerial ace again. So is he torrent? That's not torrent yet. But if he no. gets it now, he will be going at yeah. plus two. He gets crit here. He's dead. So it's really okay. Close. All right. So what is this? Plus three strats. This is plus no, two this torrent. Is plus two. Okay. Yeah. This is another fight that like has another a freeze. lot of variations. Um, you got to know how to play it correctly. Uh, this is a, a less optimal torrent Growth, plus two maybe? strats are probably the worst strats you can get. Okay, yeah, he's he could just act, he could just act, act again if he wants to. Yeah, he's going to. Yep, there's just no reason not to. Thank you to DS um, for the raid. Appreciate it, man. So now he can't miss Blizzard. Um, just which is chilling. Yeah, you can play Omega safe from here. He's gonna kill the Alakazam, yeah. kill the Ry Rhyhorn or the Rhydon, and then he'll heal. There's basic, and there's Omega basically safe, zero so. chance that he can die to this fight now if if he plays if he plays safe yeah, enough. Assuming so. right inputs and right moves being used, like yeah, yeah, it's very hard to to die from here for Amiibo. Yeah. Yeah, growth was definitely lucky there because um, uh, he'd have to. Uh, with plus two, you have to hit two blizzards on the Gyarados, yeah. um, which GGO, is not maybe. great. Still the time for his first race. I'm sure he's not crazy yeah. thrilled about it, but a nice run on the board, I mean, a nice first place to get you through the next round. Don't have to worry about it. Yeah, his considering deaths, all that happened to him. Yeah, like exactly. I would say his 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 execution was great and his RNG was great outside of. The uh, the two fights, you know, um, yep, yep. or the, yeah, outside of Surge and Liam, you know. Absolutely. So he can he can Blizzard here again, um, and he's just okay. He's he gonna just heal, play. just save. Yeah, yeah I, I respect it Wait. to be honest. Yeah, actually, no, that is that you're no, you're right. That is better. That way, you don't get double extreme speed crit, but. Wait, could he unless hit this is, Unless this is heal range, range. Oh, that's yeah, close, that would though. be so troll. <laughs> Holy. Okay, I'll get it. Let's play the century, dude. <laughs> Alright, so Amoeba is officially. Looking like a two, high 207. Maybe a low 208. Yeah, um, with three deaths, pretty solid. Um, Absolutely. Absolutely. I mean, his deaths were pretty fast, but. Um, yeah. His uh, execution prevailed. Yeah, it looks like it's going to be. Amoeba. Yeah. Look like Bang is Yo. through the Onyx. I was kind of not paying attention, but I assumed he played it correctly. Assuming he played correctly, he should be fine here. Um, so this might be his XP turn for Peasant. If this is XP turn, he just goes now. Oh, uh, his uh, defense is bad. This is where the defense 20, comes into play. Um, is this He's definitely in range. If Amiibo was 28 max, max, 
If Amiibo is 28 max, he's definitely in range here. I think this is really unlikely, but... GG Amiibo though, by the way. Oh, he's, he's playing it. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. This is bad. This is bad. If he doesn't mock punch, he's gonna rock tumor sky uppercut. Oh no! We <laughs> You got a special. It doesn't die. Yeah, okay. you got a heal. Is it rock tumor now though? Oh, yeah. oh my god! What is happening? Wait, what's happening? Uh, oh, this is so scary. Uh... Does this die? <laughs> it does. Oh, no. Uh, okay, so he no he, longer he needs has to get corn. up that third X spec. Uh, is what needs to happen, right? Oh god. Oh god. I. You, you can special here. He, he's gonna have to special here. What does this have? High jump kick? Like... Mega kick. Of course he hits. Oh, okay. Okay, he's, he's fine. fine now, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, he's good now. Oh, he's good God. now. He's in torrent. Nothing else has priority from here. He's chilling. GG though, Amoeba. Sick transition. I love it. Yep. Also, I'll give it, shout out to... Uh, I'm not sure who made it, but shout out to Bye, the... Bye, Jay. Yeah. Sajay, yes. Yeah. Shout out to you guys, man. This yeah. is awesome. I love these layouts. Um, I really think yeah, this is really. These nice. are really, really good, man. I really, uh, I really like it. GG though, Amiibo. Congratulations on your yeah victory. Amiibo finishing well. with a two hundred seven fifty seven. Pretty solid. It's in everything that happened. I mean, dude, those one in sixteen solid. Liams was unbelievable. Liams were the worst. Yeah. <laughs> I you can't. Almost, dude, it makes you almost want to go to six and not five, dude. That's crazy. Uh, is what it is. Thanks to Agatha as well. Surge death, yeah, you, you expected that, but yeah, yeah. Besides those, those, those two things, yeah, your race was definitely played really well. Solid. Thanks, man. This, this has been the crazy entertaining to keep race. Look out dude. for his amiibo to win this tournament. So, so. Peasants just so peasant. I don't know if you're watching peasants, but he was on Bruno, and he was. A very unlikely range to die to mock punch, so he played it safe and super, but then got sky uppercut, but got sky uppercut miss, and then, and then he got rock to miss, and then he got mega kick on the him only and didn't die. I mean, dude, that was crazy. Like, uh, I was worried he was gonna again that, but that's also the squirrel he's running. He runs six six defense. Oh, he got toxic turn one. Uh, this he got a re not, he's got a reset here. He doesn't. He doesn't. Wait, no, no. Uh, he has no antidotes. Okay, well, that's crazy. You got a full, okay, you either reset. I mean, if you're committing, or you forward, yeah, you form a store, yeah. Holy, or restore plus three strats. Yeah, yeah that's, that's the or plan, just reset. Yeah. I mean, I, I, I personally reset on toxic, but because this is just worse, man. Like, you got to set plus three, and only get sixteen double themes off, like. Yeah, but see, yeah, he doesn't... Okay, he's reset, okay, okay, he reset, okay. Unfortunately, he is behind now. Um... Oh, that's too bad. Yeah, could we maybe get the audio on... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. sorry. Uh, bang, sorry, if sorry. possible? No, you're good. Sorry, sorry, forgot. It's all good. Uh... Specifically, yeah, there is a lot of weird scenarios, but yeah, like the weird scenarios whenever you get toxic on Agatha or you don't get hit to the right HP on Bruno, like it definitely can have you thinking that you're making wrong plays and if you don't have the experience. Yeah, because toxic turn one is basically a reset because it, it's super unlikely, but like unless you're unless you're high torrent and you're not in shadow punch range after the poison tick, but if you are, yeah, the, no, <laughs> it's really bad. They're saying our comms might be muted at this point. No, they're good now. No, they're good, they're good. They're fine, yeah.
think. And he didn't see if he went to plus two accuracy, but it's the the important hit right there on the Dragonite. Um, Bang is in the driver's seat to win this race right now. Um, yep. Oh, there's. Wow, there's the. Okay, well, Bugless he does. Is fine. He has yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Does it matter if. Yeah, we definitely need Torrent plus one there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I wonder if it's a range to kill otherwise. I mean, it is obviously going to be, or if it's like not even going to kill, or if it's a range. Plus I one Torrent. Uh, I doubt it. I plus one Torrent when he's plus one defense or Spit F. Because that would, well, the. The plus special defense would ca counteract the plus one. Well, fifty percent without torrent apparently. Okay, yeah, I knew that. Yeah, but yeah, with torrent, it's probably guaranteed. But I guess. Bank throwing down a save. <clears throat> Peasant's getting his bite off or his special. Did I just go black train? Am I crazy? Yeah. Okay. That's very unfortunate. This is a that really was like, impressive that was like, that was like That was so weird. What were you saying? <laughs> this is a really impressive showing for peasants considering it's the first time. I agree. Time. I agree. Absolutely. Man. I think a lot of this can be like trying to hold your nerves the first time you come into it. For sure. You definitely, you know, not many didn't really make. I mean, there was a few misplays, but I mean, that, that'll that happen when you're less experienced. But overall, I mean, he got really, really trolled by missing so many Mega Kicks in the early game. Like, you think he missed like 11 or something before Rock Tunnel or some shit? Alright, I refreshed his feed. I think it fixed yeah, it. Yeah, we're good now. Yeah. We're back. <clears throat> Did not see if Bang is plus two or three. I'm literally the worst commentator, but, but if he's plus two, I mean... Ideally, you're plus three right now, so you don't have to hit a blizzard, but... Yeah, he, no, he is plus two. Wait, wait, he's plus wait, two, is, but what, what's he doing? This isn't... This is, this... Wow. That doesn't die? You're, he's dead! He's for sure and dead! That, that doesn't kill! He's dead! He flinched, though, he flinched. Synthesis! Wait... <laughs> okay, <so> Really? trolling. <laughs> that... This, this doesn't die either. Here. Uh... No, dude! He's plus no. two! This, there it is. Uh, nice. okay. You gotta surf again. We're good. Yeah, he screwed up. <laughs> he, 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 he messed up the plus two and plus yeah, three strats. The play yeah, there like, at that point was what the pack was. Was, pack was you have to, yeah. yeah. That's that's yeah. what Amiibo, you were plus two, I think, in that spot, yeah. too. You just, yeah. uh, you only get the bite surf on plus three and torrent. Peasant's coming in the champ is now, as well. Yeah, if he, if he didn't flinch and gotten solar, he was for sure dead. Yeah, but from here, it, assuming Bang plays very like plays safe, you really can't lose from this situation. Still, right? you could still miss Blizzard. True. Um, yeah, he yeah. didn't act. He did not act. Yeah, that's a good point. Yeah, it's yeah, it's unfortunate for peasants that Bang didn't get punished for for, for that for screwing that shot up, but. Yeah, that on, yeah, that would have definitely swung it into his favor. Yeah, for sure. So Bang's gonna opt to X-Act now, I guess. That's fine. I mean, yeah, at this point you probably just double X-Act, and it's, it, unless you get crit. Yeah, okay. Never mind. That's classic. Just heal again. Yeah. Another critical hit on the right side as well. That's crit galore right now. And again, I do not. I think. Peasants might only be plus two as well because he got crit, so. But he also got okay. a couple sands, so I think he's probably fine. What, dude? Watch this be heal range. That'd be hilarious if he like hit hit him. So no, it probably wouldn't be, but no. Yeah, I realized that that might have been an All issue right. after I GG. did what I did. Yeah, GG. GG. I, I agree with the play. I I actually didn't think yeah. about confusion in the, in the heal range either. <laughs> um. Yep. Yeah, so. That's bang with the second place finish. Crit crit stream speed does not do 135. Let's see strengths or something. Yep, he went nice and slow to surf. Yep, exactly. <laughs> Very nice. And then same situation for peasants over here. Definitely cannot die, assuming right things are happening. <clears throat> Yep, 
Yiji Bang guaranteed advance with the uh, second place, so yep. sure he's very happy about that. Probably not happy with his performance, but he kind of got trolled a yeah. bunch of spots. So. Yeah, a lot of crazy stuff happened. I definitely I mean, will see was... him bounce back in the next round. I for that sure. was definitely a, a sick race for sure. Um, a lot of in a lot of entertaining stuff happened. <laughs> Yeah, I, I hope I hope peasants advances for sure because I mean there's a, there's definitely a chance. Um, he's got to beat out two other uh, yeah. round three runners, but um, he uh, he's he's got a lot of promise for sure. I mean this uh, yeah, this he, one's he, going to be a yeah. faster time than his actual PB. <laughs> well, his race PB is a two ten, so yeah. Um, he is uh, he's yeah he's in range here, so I mean oh he's going for it. okay yeah. Oh, that's a good as well. Jeez. Two, two Charmander runs in round one, there's a pretty good chance that one of those could go out. Yeah, it, it, well, it, it, I, well, Blue Mag was the big, like, wild card. I'm, I'm actually not, I've never seen him run the game, so I don't know, even with Squirtle, yeah, I don't know what his Blue, time I've would be. I've seen Blue do a couple runs, and they're doing Char, aren't they? Or is that supposed to be a surprise? I don't know. No, uh, I see and Anna will be doing I see and Anna are doing Char. Oh, Blue Magma, yeah. definitely, I doubt it. I mean, yeah, if you don't even know the Squirtle route. That but I, wouldn't, the... I wouldn't sleep on Blue. He could definitely Not have at all. been, uh, definitely, uh, definitely yeah, been yeah. working in the background, potential. Yeah, yeah, and I mean, yeah, the Charmander thing will be pretty, uh, pretty entertaining, for sure. I have no idea what times they could get with that, but probably, my guess would be like 210 with their skill level, but... If Blue's, Blue's a top runner in Sapphire, so I have no doubt in my mind that if he wanted to get good and get to a top level in this game... He'd yeah, maybe do he's that. been doing a training arc, you know, behind yeah. the scenes. Hello, Hello guys. Bang, GG's, man. Congratulations I... on advancement. Thanks. I said this last year in my race versus Nerdy, and I will say it again. Un most undeserved second place of all time. <laughs> Man, yeah. what was... I don't the, know. The can, the cans, I just gotta ask, what happened on the can situation? Like, yeah, dude, you lost the can, can or something. <laughs> um, this might come as a su surprise to you, but the search gym is actually pretty tricky. You know, you have to find the first can, and then you have to check the other cans around the first can. But I kinda, for I kinda forgot how how this shit worked. So I don't know. Uh, you got you got through there though. You got through the end. I don't know. And then the uh, risky rocket death. I mean, True, I was yeah. at weird HP. I had to do risk, risky rocket. Then I died to rival. To, well, to there's rival. always hiker. There's always hiker, man. Yeah, but I was at plus twenty. I was at plus twenty H HP. Even a quick attack from the next red wouldn't have gotten me into torrent unless crit. And as I thought, nah. Yeah. Uh, oh, yeah. Man, this GG man. GGs. I, two options, man. Yo, peasants, man. I'm very sorry that you didn't advance yet man oh know. fingers crossed i still might but such, but such yeah, that was race, man. <laughs> it was uh, it was close between us and yeah, bruno almost like, got you man <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah he got I, I was in i did i think i did it right it was just like i was in the range well, to, i had to heal because it was a 27 to 29 and i was at 28 health pay, hp for my defenses. well it was probably a high roll range so he didn't pseudo roll mock punch yeah. so that's why he sky uppercutted you instead but yeah, and then, and then he, missed. he missed. That was crazy. Yeah. <laughs> I thought and I, you probably don't die to that, but yeah, that was just very weird. Yeah, weird, Bruno. Yeah, yeah. I got, I'm glad it didn't. I mean, I, I got toxic on Agatha anyway, so I just lost. Yeah, that was. Yeah, <laughs> yeah no, you got to just reset spells, instantly so when you see that. Yeah. Uh -oh. One thing, if I had one, antidote, one thing I want to ask. Okay, I think. Oh, yeah. uh, I I went to plus three on Pid Pidgeot, no, on the champion. No, you didn't. You went oh, to plus, two. plus your, two. Your guards, your guard spec ran out on the uh, Venusaur, so that's why I knew. That's how I knew. Uh, it was only plus two. I was so confused when Bite Surf didn't kill, and I was like, okay, am I gonna die here now or what? <laughs> and then he yeah, just, you you got he lucky. Just... He didn't Solar Beam you turn one. Yeah, or... um, I guess rich get richer, right? <laughs> Yeah, peasants. So two two nineteen, <laughs> considering that you missed more kicks than you hit, is really good. Yeah. It's actually yeah. insane. Like, look, I yeah. died twice to rival, and then I missed two on Oddish, two on other Oddish, one on yeah. I think it was like eleven well, or twelve. Actually, maybe. I meant to comment on that. Why did you not bite after you crit? Because you didn't need to kick. Because you could have. I, I know the, it's like a rival two, I, the I've, first death. Yeah, yeah. Specifically, I've done that because I've crit with bite before and then bit and then it didn't kill. And so I yeah I 
I didn't it, know. You, you, you got to gauge how low he is. Yeah. If it's yeah. If, if, well, you, yeah, you you can sort of tell, but yeah, I, I get it. But yeah, that definitely yeah. sucks. That's happened to me once before, so I just I didn't go for it. But then I was thinking afterwards, wow, that was really stupid. I definitely should have went for it. Yeah. <laughs> Especially with how bad the second fight ended up going as well. Also, I missed a one percent kick, so I will add five dollar to the price price pool. I saw that. Yeah, That's... I was I was laughing and crying at the same same time, <laughs> and and then. My right, my my boat ride, and man, oh, such a shit show! Oh god, so many things went went wrong so terribly in this race. Yeah, I, mean, I, got, so uh, much. I mean, you guys kept it very close between each other, even though Amoeba did pull ahead. But I mean, you guys were literally neck and neck pretty much the yeah. whole time. So it was, it was, you guys still made it a good watch. So it was, it was just like a bunch of terrible stuff happening to to me and Bang. Like I think I ran out of. Yeah, I ran out of paralyzed heals because I got triple paralyzed. Oh no! Like, <laughs> so I like it was just before I jumped down after versing Alicia. So I went back to Cerulean and picked up paralyzed heals because I would. No, really. Just... Yeah, that was an interesting one. Yeah, <laughs> that's never happened to me before. Anything uh, anybody you wanna uh, drop in there? Yeah, Ren uh, Randall, thanks, thanks for the follow. Yeah, thank you, man. <laughs> um, just yeah, so me. anybody that's interested tomorrow. What is it? Eleven p. Eleven thirty p. I got him on the stream. The these are the upcoming oh, races. That, oh my god! This is fire! <laughs> this Holy over. shit! This is actually beautiful. <laughs> yep. Yep. Thanks to Side J. Yep. Yeah. Good luck, NA. <laughs> so we yeah, got two yeah, races look tomorrow. At it. <laughs> yeah, around we got the same time <laughs> tomorrow. Nice. Yeah. Three races. And then oh, no, two for I'm stupid. for Thursday, yeah, we got Anna and Icy and Blue Magma. Uh, and then an icy are running Charmander, so yeah, that will be a. Will be Wait, so we're um, just real quick. Red, 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 red. Oh, okay. This is a uh, military time. Makes sense. Okay. I was I was confused if we were going to do AM or PM here, but it's the military only time. Uh, the only correct time time to use, right? Yeah. Yeah. And yep, you all at Eastern time, and yeah. yeah, no problem. Man. I appreciate you guys putting on a good race and looking forward and hoping all you guys can make it to the next round. So. Yeah. yeah, thanks yeah. for the, all the commentary and stuff. That was dope. No yeah, that was yeah. a fun race. Yeah, so we'll see you guys tomorrow. For, yeah, uh, thank you guys. See you then. On this, yeah. Yeah. Cool. Later.